Bonsoir. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. Hello, everyone. And welcome aboard the Sunset Rail in session 23 of Throne Top Sands. And I am their voice. Uh, hiya, Frankie. How you doing? Hello, Octa Darling. What up? Beep boop to you, too. Hello, Lucy. Hello, Georgia. And hello, Lyco. Also, hello, Sam. How goes it? How you guys doing? How are all the things? I hope you've been having a grand week. I'm having a grand week. I'm very excited. I am in a very good mood because we're playing D&D. How is all the things? Um, I'm going to quickly just go over a few things uh, over our sponsors. Um, the blah, blah recap last session. And I think that's everything I wanted to say at the beginning. I did also like, probably will show like some of the attunement stuff. Hello, Vix. Oh, sorry. Or oh, bye-bye, Vix. I didn't just see you just there when you're not 20 on your look. Sorry. Oh, uh, luckily. Uh, if Vix was here, I would say hello, but like she's not, obviously. So I hope you're doing good and all the makeup stuff went well. That was it was, it was fun stopping by for a hot second. Um, yes. Hello, everyone. Hi. Uh, pop, 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 pop. Before we get into the session, I'm just going to quickly just shout out a few of our sponsors and a few other things. First sponsor, it's me. I do tokens and I do homebrew stuff. You might have heard me mention my Kofi. Uh, I upload my uh, yokai stat blocks and token art up on um, up on Kofi. Uh, right now there is the Shabbaton and the Greatest Shabbaton, the Oni and the Suiko, and that was October's uh, batch. I'm going to be preparing um, November's set, and like they'll be coming out like in the next few, like up until the end of November, and probably in December as well, because like I'm very bad with scheduling this kind of stuff. But don't worry about it. Um, and like if you subscribe to the uh, to the channel, you do get uh, access to some of uh, the content as well uh, on Discord. You'll either get access to depending on the month uh, tokens or the stat block. And you'll get access to those um, as they come out on Kofi as well. So if you want half of the content, you can grab them on the Discord if you are subbed here. And also, it's appreciated if you uh, do support the channel. It does help with all the kind of content I produce and want to produce. And helps uh, helps make it easier to keep going and keep making more. Where is all the things I was going to say? Um, yeah, that's my coffee. If you enjoy some of the art that you see on stream, right now this is an illustration by Sam Edgar. There is no fan art showing. That'll explain why that felt very weird. Sorry. Uh, the fan art also is by um, a mix of the cast and also uh, just people from the Discord. And if you want to uh, join the Discord and share some of the art you do, take part in our art nights and movie nights and game nights and all the other wonderful stuff we do, you can uh, hop in uh, into the vibe in there. If you enjoy the art that you also see that isn't um, either the map assets or uh, the fan art or this, uh, the uh, illustration by Sam Elliger, you can uh, see some of my art on Instagram and my Twitters. I haven't uploaded the poly art just yet, but that'll be up soon with a few other stuff um, for like the sessions and stuff. And also like you'll see all the other stuff I've produced for TAS and my commissions and stuff. And if, yeah, if you enjoy my art and want to see all the things, you can on my Instagram and my Twitter's there. Um, and if you want to catch up on all the previous sessions of Throne Top Sands, you can on YouTube here. Um, it includes Jahas, Rocky, and our Christmas Christmas one shot um, into the Rocky verse in their little. I want to say the canonical order. I haven't found the perfect way to order it just yet, but that's all there. We're still slowly editing away till like, I cut away at the um, the. The bulk of the intros in those streams, but uh, slowly we'll get there. We'll uh, we'll have all those sorted. But onto our sponsors, um, other than myself and the Funi, there is Bard RPG. They are uh, you might have seen me work on art for a, a TTRPG asset called Bard RPG. It's a genre agnostic tool that you'd be able to use to create uh, narratives, build more uh, in-depth stories, and a much just a more streamlined way to include everyone at the table um, and it is designed to be usable in any uh, TTRPG of your choice and just storytelling in general so if you want to grab a hold of that we are working on the art for that at the moment and it is currently being written but it should be ready to roll out sometime in uh, spring or summer 2023 is what I think is the deadline or the planned um, the planned end date for that 
the next thing is dice roll. You might have seen some of the dice I've uh, shown on stream before. Uh, there is like the, the cat, uh, blue cat eye gemstone, my rainbow dice, or my. Um, I actually got some new dice. There was the the demons, uh, the demons eye dice I won from their giveaway that they do on their discords. And if you want to grab some of your own dice that are cheap or affordable, cheap is also the same word. I was going to use both affordable, uh, high quality, and just pretty dice. You can uh, grab them at DiceRoll.uk using the link um, with slash KazaDM to help support the stream as well. And uh, yeah, help fuel that dice addiction of yours if you want to. I I wouldn't say I, I have a bias to push you to do that, but I, I'd say you should do it, personally. Um, other, after that, there is Just Very Mundane. Uh, there's two podcasts on the planet, and the, one of them is run by Piper. Our I should change that <laughs> Um, they, uh, uh, Piper and his uh, roommate Saga, or his friend Saga, I don't know if they're roommates anymore, um, they do a podcast where they do, they cover life advice, just talk about run, random stuff, it's very mundane, you should go check him out, support anything Piper does, because he is wonderful. Next is Georgia Mar Jewelry, Georgia makes jewelry, if you didn't know, a lot of cool, stunning, beautiful sets of silver, um, currently she has the Silver Dragon Sword, but she's also working on some stuff. Um, she's got these really cute little low pendants. I don't know like what's the plan with those, but they look really cool. So you should go check out her stuff and get her jewelry. Also, they'd be great Christmas presents, I, I would say. Um, not, not to be biased about it, I think it'd be neat though. Um, and there's the other podcast, uh, We're So Fucking Sorry, which is hosted by Remove Sam, who played Taya uh, during Jailhouse Rocky, and Lucy, who's playing Polly. In, uh, who's also guesting in the session of Front Up Sands. And you can uh, check out their hilarious little bite sized podcast that they probably want a cracker. Does she want a cracker? I don't know. Does she like crackers? Yeah. <laughs> you can um, you can catch them on Spotify and all the other places just like um, Just Very Mundane. And uh, yeah, they're hilarious. It's chaotic. It's a wild fun time. You should go check it out. And I'm, I'm also guesting. On, oh, I guessed it once on the podcast once. We were meant to be talking about R, and I think we started talking about Yu-Gi-Oh. That might have been in the pre-stream, I can't remember. Who knows? Polly don't want a cracker? Oh, I see, she's not allowed. No charcuterie for you. I see. But yeah, that's that. We're going to go into the um, intro in a second, and then we're going to start the session. So see you guys in a hot sec. I lie, I forgot I had to recap the session as well. I am stupid. Yeah. So after uh, returning from the mater uh, to the material plane, Lone Nico and Yuki uh, reunite with their companions, Randall, Rocky, and um, what's his name, the robot boy, uh, Lo <laughs> Boy Boy. Um, and during the re uh, reunion, she apologized for the danger and just the threat of um, death that she had imposed on the party during her trial by fire. Uh, bringing with her a few parting gifts for Rocky and Randall uh, from Taya, Moran, and uh, Kano when they had left, um, when they departed from Otherworld, or departed after Lash and Sora into Otherworld. Um, bringing with them some Golden Sun brooches, uh, Moran's Haori and her hairband, Taya's mask and a few arrowheads, and uh, saying goodbye to their friends. Um, after they had rested, Satoshi, uh, the captain of the Raid Lake, Raid Lake airship, uh, had announced that they'll probably need to walk the rest of the way as the uh, the airship was out of uh, out of energy. So, turning and get down into a little origami boat, they had uh, made their way uh, to Otani Forest, having been called by some crows um, that had been beckoning the Pai through their dreams and through Lo's uh, trial towards uh, the west, towards the forest. Upon entering, they would encounter a Bakoran craftswoman uh, called Polly that was running away from a, uh, an Oni uh, that the group had rescued her from, and but then very suddenly grow extremely suspicious as they saw a familiar crate wash up on the shores of the riverside uh, that gave a little uh, familiar golden glint from within. Oh, Hello Spectacrum, what up? Butt ahead, oh no. I'm known for them in real life. You know for what? Paul for crackers? I love chachu cheese. Please, man, come on. I'm so sad. I see. 
Lucille got roasted. She roasted coffee. But yeah, I'll um, we're gonna we're gonna go to the intro in a hot second, and then we're gonna go straight into all the things. So I'll see you guys in a hot second. April Fools, if we do a stream, we should like literally do a karaoke rendition of the need to get on stocks of cars when you rub against the wall and you cannot find us a car. Roll twenty. It's safe. Say no. <laughs> oh, I, so I'm looking at like a tra like fifty percent transparency OBS and Chrome on each other. It's weird. Uh, <laughs> turn off. Turn off. Turn off. <laughs> <laughs> Go off OBS. Okay. Wait, I gotta move you guys. To the, you're on the wrong screen. No. Bye. Right. Also, hello everyone. Welcome to session 23 of. Hello. 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 Hi. Oh, good. Let me just zoom. Oh. You already got the 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 teaser for what the April Fools throw <laughs> 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 That one, you get that one for free. Let's see when when, when is the first April stream. It's been a long time. <laughs> when will be our April stream? It will be... Oh! Sunday, so like, uh, on the it second. It actually will? It'll be on oh. the second. If, if it is like on the first week of April, it'll be on the second, so... We'll just miss it. 
But yeah, um, hello everyone. We've just we've, oh. we've done the recap, so we're gonna. You guys ready to go straight into the things? Oh. As straight as I can. Let's go. I'm trying. Alright, I'm gonna. <clears throat> I mean, you guys know how. Oh shit, wrong player. You guys know. <laughs> <laughs> you guys Sorry, know how we're healing and we're uh, sucked on okay. before, before the stream. Mm -hmm. oh. If you guys remember the end of last session, you had just destroyed an Oni, and I saw a. Oni chan! Alright, that's it. Lofi boy's I'm dead. I'm going to kill yourself. <laughs> Yeah, let's Throw him in the river. Myself. <laughs> Let me just change I the place. I had to do it once, okay? Just one time. That was it. <laughs> Fucking can't believe this guy. But yeah, you guys had just seen a little glint of gold in one of those crates on the sh uh, on the waters, and oh, ignore that. Ignore that. <laughs> I'm ignoring. <laughs> I didn't see nothing happen. <laughs> just ran a cartwheel. She's <laughs> 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 a bit <laughs> <laughs> so the black jack. <laughs> yeah, and uh, yeah, Randa, how did uh, because you you had the the moment last at the end of last session. What uh, what are you doing? I'm like pressed up to Polly pretty much at this point, just uh -huh. like. What are you doing with these crates? I listen, I don't know about any crates. I was here and then the mountain exploded and then there was a demon and now all you people are here and I'm <sighs> She just starts like hyperventilating. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, um I don't have a plastic bag, but I have a handkerchief um blowing this, I guess. What's a plastic bag? <laughs> <laughs> something something about hotel, don't worry about it. They they started charging for it whenever you go by uh Two cool. plastic bags, exact <laughs> bags do exist. Uh, so, yeah. What, so, what's up with the barrels? Just you know, we don't gotta. We could all just be chill about this. Uh, Listen, I'm being honest when I'm saying I have no. I didn't even notice the barrels. I'm. I was just trying to pass through the forest, and then everything went... I'm talking, like, really wrong. Oh. You mean the Oni? Yeah, yeah, that was a little bit not good. Um, a lot of it, uh, for sure. Yeah, a little bit not good. You want to investigate those crates, Lo-Fi Boy? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He's just on climbing. <laughs> what are you doing, Lo-Fi? <laughs> lo <-fi? laughs> Also, a reminder, Randall, about the map. And chat, a uh, reminder about the map uh, that you have access to. Yeah, yeah, uh, you, you yeah. Also, chat, you guys can, if you want to, you can help and hinder the party with your channel points using lair actions and uh, special character actions. Yeah. Help, help, help. <laughs> 13. Still good vibes out there. I'm still good vibes. Yeah, you're manifesting. All right, with your 13 investigation, you... Uh, yeah, it's like you, like the crate isn't like fully open. It's just like uh, like one of the corners has been like just torn open by the side of the uh, the river, and you can just see within like the silhouettes and the, the well not silhouette even like you can they're very distinct shapes of um, golden statues frozen in various states of terror. Um, ah. You only really can see that from like the the first like three uh, as like the like it's packed. Uh, completely in. You can only see like the, as it gets further, like it gets a bit too dark to see further in. But it is like you can assume just full of these golden statues that you you recognize. I, I, I guess... Wait, what? 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 You, what? You, what you, do you mean I recognize? You'd recognize like the expressions on these faces from those statues in that one village. You guys do had. People really... oh, okay. Okay. Oh. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, in that one village. You go in that on. one village. Also, everyone, pause to check and hydrate. Oh! Sippy, sippy! That's your only way I can help slow, the crew out. <laughs> oh! 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 What is that? Is That's there a poster low. check? Yeah, we poster checked. What, what do you mean? Was singing I a song or something. 
I thought that was like, the noise you made when you, <laughs> when you had to like break your back or whatever. Oh, yeah. No, 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 no. Uh, that's all my boy realizing that these okay. are like the people. That's what I mean. Uh, uh, like, Lofaipo <laughs> just walks away from them. And then, um. They're um, all dressed very similarly as well from in the crew. Okay, okay, that's enough details. I don't need to think on it anymore. <laughs> um, uh, like, uh, like that's enough information. Um, and you yeah, did see uh, the. <laughs> the pain Stop, scratched on the enough. side, mentioning Kasakawa <laughs> Factory. Oh, okay, so, well, um, so, you guys, well, Randall, well, Loniko and Rocky, remember that one village where, um, oh. you know, the, the Golden Village, you know, it's, yeah. it's hard to not remember. Yeah, I remember it. I remember yeah, so imagine like that, but like inside of the crate. And what? I, I just mean like the people are the statues. It, it's it, that's what's inside. And it looks like it was heading towards Kasakara Factory. No, these are coming down. These ones. Oh, coming down from Kasakara Factory. Yeah. Oh. No, yeah, the, the, like the stream is going. Um, you guys are heading west, so the stream is yeah. heading south. So it's going like this way, to away. So I don't know if I don't know what it means, but it's like if it came from Kasakawa Factory. <clears throat> what came from Kasakawa Factory? Satoshi asks. As they just came, like, just like dusting themselves off from having <sighs> punched the Oni. <laughs> I don't know, like these golden people, but maybe they came from other villages. The, the, well, I, I mean, the clothing were, were, were rather similar. Maybe, uh, maybe, maybe it's some of the same people. I, 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 I don't know, but like whatever it is, golden people aren't cool. Um, I, I mean, do they need help? Are they are they okay? Satoshi asks. Yes. You know what? The last time I remember, um, they're dead. Oh. Yeah. Sorry, did you just say there are dead people in that box? Where are you- where'd oh, you come from? Are... That box? Um, no, I... I gotta get out of here. This is- this is too much. Sorry, thank you for saving me. It was very nice to meet you, but, uh, this is, you know, my mother was right. I maybe should have stayed at home. Uh, oh, and that's then... a lot. Uh, I'm I'm sorry, Miss. Um, my name's Luniko. Um, uh, what's what's your name? Do you live around here? Um, we're we're a little bit lost, I suppose. Um, you can point us in the direction of old um, old Artani village, could you? Um, at least. Hey, uh, Luniko. I'm I'm Polly, and you know I would love, I would really love to help you out. Um, except I uh I'm also lost. Um, oh. So, yeah. But yeah, you don't have to worry about the dead people. Like it's the yokai that you have to worry about, and the one I we kind just of fought feel like is I should also be worried dead. About the dead people. I mean, uh, For I mean, reason, yes. Yeah, but like, yeah, I'm just uh, at this point, like, and I point at the earth and the trees and everything. Everything is kind of alive until it isn't anymore, you know? Like... It, it's... Um, yeah, that's generally how that works. No, 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 but what I mean is, like, um... So, I wouldn't worry as much about the dead people as the thing making them dead. How? <laughs> And while we have no idea how close or far away that person responsible for those deaths are, but I mean, if you think on the bright side, um, and I can I do a perception check? <laughs> mm -hmm. um, Holly, I think what my friend is trying to say is, uh, if you're lost as well, um. There's probably more yokai in these woods, and it might be safer, you know, uh, safer to travel in numbers. 
as you say that, oh. you see the ground under Satoshi just like start cracking. And then just a white light shine upwards out of the ground and then just <laughs> push him. Or push them onto Oh shit! <laughs> and like just knock them to the ground. And they get they take eight radiant damage. As just uh -huh. this beam of light just shoots out of the ground. Um uh, uh, the bright side. <laughs> oh goodness. I need uh, Satoshi, no. <laughs> he just steps That's a bit up. Too bright. It was very bright, yeah. It's like just, just a sudden burning light. Um, is there still a hole in the ground? No, it closes <laughs> up immediately. Can I plunge my sword into it? <laughs> you can, go ahead. Roll strength for me. With your 70, what did you want to perceive? Um. So, honestly, I wanted to just see if, like, the... Weird, because we, we, we heard a roar or something like that when you we were did. in the village or a big sound. So I'm kind of like trying to see any signs of like something big having moved through the forest oh. or any big sounds that would uh, mm -hmm. give that away. Did we hear glitching from across the river? You did. You heard glitching over here. And like there was like glitch over here. Oh, okay. And uh, with that like, <laughs> okay, with that 17, okay. <laughs> you looking around, you don't see anything that like like that shadow that you saw in that village, but you do right. see every now and then just this horse elk like creature that like would like walk through the trees and like disappear in between like a few uh, a few of them and just like appear and you can just see like jewelry gl glinting off of their like um, mm -hmm. horns and like as they've got like these just beads strewn over them and they just like kind of prance in between the shadows, watching you very curiously, but then disappearing as soon as like they pass through another tree. Ah. Um. You feel their eyes constantly on you, though. Um. On the bright side, you know, you we were never alone. Uh, we <laughs> always got each other's back. So if you're <laughs> alone, you'll be probably more dead than. When you're not, yeah. as Satoshi just starts also punching at the ground with you, Randall. Uh, <laughs> did, did my thirteen manage to do it? You said, yeah. You plunge your sword into the ground as Satoshi goes to punch at it. As, oh and, my god! Then, it's so stupid. As they, uh, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, sorry. Go go go. As they punch at the ground, they also come. Yeah, no, you should. It's it's better to travel in numbers. Um. Oh shit! Yeah, you like kind of like pull away at the ground as you like plunge your sword, and then Satoshi's fist just goes straight in at the point you had uh, plunged your sword, and you see the ground just tear open. Um, I pushed it up a little bit for you. Yeah. Oh, thank you. As you look in it, it's just it's just dirt and soil underneath. Can I do like an arcana check or something <laughs> for whatever <laughs> happened to, to mm -hmm. Satoshi? You can. Roll. I'm going to say with advantage because you are a caster. I haven't seen anything like that. Why oh, does wow. that always happen? <laughs> <laughs> That's got to be its own little, little reward, you know? Mm, 219. Well, like just doubles. Yeah. Snake eyes. It's exploding dice. You get a lot of <laughs> oh. um, but yeah, no, with your 19, you like. You've not. You've witnessed. A, like when you were traveling with Lucera on the way here. When you were traveling on your way here, you did walk through a few battlefields. Um, mm -hmm. And, like, when you'd walk through, like, areas that were where it, there was very much intense combat or just a abundance of magic used, you sometimes, like, that magic lingered and radiated, essentially, like, would, like, linger and like, just latch onto whatever it, it could. And um, you've you, even through like your own like, just research and like going to school and stuff, you've like read up on stuff like this. You've Shreleo is full of these wild magic surge pockets that just appear at certain uh, spots and events. Usually during uh, in like at battlefields when like the battles have uh, ended, or even like arenas where like people like do like little magic shows and stuff. And this is no exception. Like you can assume the magic that like is bleeding from Kasakawa Mountain 
is just swarming the area and is causing the ground to just suddenly surge with magic every now and then. And you could say it's on a timer of every oh. 20 minutes. With that oh. 19, I'll, I'll give you that. You want to use your magical awareness there, uh, Lofo boy? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, on the creature thing, I'm wondering if it's using like some kind of like magical energy to appear and disappear. Mm-hmm. Um, can you like how's okay. it? Uh, can you just put in how it works? Exactly? Yeah, yeah, just to, like I'm um, um, like. Um. Basically, it's. Like, you, you mean mechanically, you wanted the explanation, or... Yeah, it was like mechanics, the... yeah. Is the... this fine, the little text? Yeah, yeah. that's perfect, that's perfect. Okay, yeah, cool. there is no, like, magic being cast, other than, like, the wild magic that's just, like, around you. What, like, that that creature's movements are not related to any spell being cast. By okay. Or something. Else. Uh, so during this whole time, I've just kind of like been like walking around, kind of looking for it in a way, mm -hmm. trying to 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 gauge the the magical thing. Yeah. Um. Um. You do also right. see like these mushrooms just growing at the roots of these trees as well as you like look around. Yeah, on the left side. <laughs> yeah. Um. So, um, guys, there's this other thing other than the, 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 um, the, the golden people. Um, there's, uh, can I, with my, and I put basically, uh, my weapon back into its umbrella form and try to make an ugly drawing of the floor. Mm -hmm. Well, I don't try to make it ugly. It's just... <laughs> you want to roll <laughs> slight a hand? To try and... Yeah, yeah. Um, slight and ten. So yeah, ugly. <laughs> it's yeah, it's like a very crude drawing. If you guys want to try and see if you know what this thing is, you can roll a. I'm gonna insight. say insight check. Yeah, with low, I'll give you advantage on this one as well. Oh shit. Randall, Polly, you can also roll insights. That's okay. 24. Yeah, Polly, Rocky, you have no clue. You just see this guy drawing, uh, drawing a very just weird looking horse. Is that a whale? <laughs> I thought. I th no, no, I thought no. It was no a dog with two heads. That could it's be a dog with two heads. A whale with two heads? No, a the, the, dog the whale horns. Dog whale. We got no, it. No, 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 no. This is clearly it's gotta be a, a sheep. Dog whale. This is a sheep. Look, it's got the wool. Yeah, that's what the toll she just says, pointing at like all the like. Yes, sheep. Look, it's all bulbous and stuff. No, cows are dog whales. I've I've sailed many seas and I don't remember seeing dog whales in my entire life. Oh, is it a Karen of my boy tails? A what? A Karen. I know that. Uh, if you want to roll religion or history, you can. Randall, you also know that this is a Karen as well. It's not in the book of yokais and stuff, right? It wouldn't be, no. Oh, okay. Uh, I saw them when I, I fell through the weed. Oh. Well, there's one uh, walking around us and, and watching us right now. I just did a, 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 a um, little magical awareness thingamajig. It's kind of like when I position myself for the weapon, but like I just kind of get a vibe of like what kind of magic you thing is about and there was nothing magical about it so i don't think it's related to the energy thing that just happened what did you see it doing uh, lonico when you were in the weave oh well it was when i was falling through it and there were like they were like spider webs, sort of, and i was falling through the threads and they were snapping and they were like standing on the threads um, but I don't think they mean any harm. Is it you... about you? Is it is it about you then? Like watching um... you. Um. I, I uh, can I try to see this thing? Is that just a perception roll? Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, <laughs> yeah, roll perception. Now I'm spooked. <laughs> I will say, um, 
with your love for with your religion and like well, Lonika, you won't need to roll for this. You know Kirin. They are essentially the guardians of like they they the they the watchers beyond the weave. Like they just watch and like they are the closest bonded animal familiars to the like material plane. Like whereas like like they, they their domain is Earth. Like where like the um where like um the Soranaga is fire, uh the koi fish are water and um the raiju are air. This uh the Kirin is of uh, Earth, and they're essentially the guardians of, of the domain. And you guys know that, yeah, they'll just watch through the weaves. And you, when Lonico uh, mentions the web, and Lonico, you also will recall when you were looking in the cave with the Shaban uh, very early on in the campaign, you mm. remember you might have seen webs inside mm. those portals, similar to those webs you saw when you were falling through the weave. Low, with your perception, you can't seem to find it, uh, can't see it. But Randall, you see one very clearly over here. And it just like it just watches. From um from a distance, and like it's very far away, but like while it's watching, like it would like step in between the trees and then move over here. Well, if it's if we're worth watching so much then Something must be afoot. Oh, um, actually, that um, that last of energy, um, that pushed you back, Captain. Um, oh. I know what that is. What is it? Uh, it's a wild magic surge, or well, the magic from Casa is. Oh, um, goodness. Making. I saw some when I was traveling. <laughs> it's it's fine, and they're sort of on a timer. They'll happen kind of around every twenty minutes. Mm. Well, we, we best watch our steps, everyone. Um, yes. But yeah. You... How, how long has it since the last... How long has it been since the last search? You can roll for me a intelligence <laughs> check if you want to try and remember. Wait, let me see. I was walking there, and then by the number of steps that I took and the time that it takes usually for me to walk, and pacing like this and trying to find where to do the intelligence check. Um, if I'm even smart enough as a human being to be able to click on one thing. <laughs> well, oh, it's actually it just alphabetical, stole right? Yeah. Oh, oh, no, it's not. It's right there. Okay, yeah. So that would mean... I mean it is alphabetical. Oh, yeah, not but like, that one. Not, not the, not <laughs> so, 11. All right, so... Yeah. All I'm going to tell you is <laughs> you can't... You you guys can't recall how much time has passed, but I'll give you one thing, Lo-Fi Boy. The timer isn't related to in-game time, but IRL time. That's, that's what I thought, but I still don't know how much time it's been IRL. Don't you worry, I've got, I've got a timer right here. Oh, cool. uh, uh, chat. Okay. oh it's all good. Could someone in chat roll for me a d6, please? Oh, no. <laughs> and yeah, you guys can like continue moving, continue doing your traveling. As uh, mm -hmm. Miss Miss Polly, uh, you wouldn't happen to know yeah. where this river does flow, would you? Uh, I, I'm not entirely sure. When you ask that, Satoshi, oh, I I would know. This I mean, this goes out to sea. This this is gone. This is this is one of the the mountain the the rivers that go from the mountain. As Does he pulls, the river go towards Otani? They pull out their map again. The, the air map that they have. Hmm. So, if I... I'm going to pull you all over to the world map. Yeah. You guys... Uh, like, if I'm going to move everyone... I'm going to make Satoshi <laughs> tiny. Make us all to scale. Uh, I, I don't think that's physically possible. <laughs> like, three <laughs> pixels each. Satoshi's, like, you, you there... And like the rivers, like there's not one on the map, but the river is essentially like going outwards south here. And you guys are heading west, just general, just the general west direction. Okay, so if we go, and if we should learn. cross the river, yes. Yeah. If it helps, the map isn't in like north in this cardinal directions. North would be to the left. South is to the right. Uh, if you want, I could put a compass on the map for you guys. 
I mean, it should be okay. All right. On the oh, where we are about, I see. Okay. Yeah. I just uh, I might want to get this crate out of the water and try to take out people and pay some respects to some people. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, Would, uh, any, anyone be okay with helping with that? Uh, Satoshi, I'm not the strongest is... myself. I, I also want to. I want to help. Thank, thank you, Rocky. Whatever it is. makes us moving the faster. Um, mm -hmm. If like, yeah. I won't need you guys to roll it because you guys like. Who else is helping? Uh, is it just the these three? Right. Uh, I was gonna try and myself. help with an extra mage hand, just because <laughs> I'm perfect. Hell yeah! You send your little, you send I'm little just fire sort of hand. standing. Polly, you're just watching it. Um, without like with Lowe's, Lowe's mage hand uh, holding on as well, and you all just kind of just like tr try fishing it out of the water, and start like pulling it in. It does scratch every now and then as you're just dragging it and like tear it like tearing some of the the crate open as you're pulling it because of the force of just the um it's weight pushing down and the rocks um on the riverside but you guys are able to pull it out of the water and get a better look inside as you can see it is just full of random prisoners an assortment of prisoners from within kasakawa prison no one that i remember not anyone you remember okay I, uh, I think we should get them out of here and perhaps dis display them in a, in a way to get them out into the world and, I don't know. I just They're would dead. rather them be out, out than stuck in some box in the dark. I mean, we can dig a hole. Or something. We can oh. dig a hole. We wouldn't that be against like that would put them in another dark place yeah but it's a bit more traditional hmm. yeah, I, I mean we could I don't give know them if I like the idea of, of burying them either though if i'm being honest we could we could give them a funeral this is, this river goes out to the sea and they'd be able to go to the lash and Sora from there uh so until she turns to loniko that, that is the more traditional way in charlio so we build a raft burying. We could build like because they're little... gonna sink. Hmm. We could. I mean, we could build a pie and like put the ashes out. We could do that. Burn the gold. Mhm. Mm I don't know how. Long. Melt it. I, I, I don't know what we could do. I, that's the only thing I can. I can. Think I mean, of if we. Go ahead. You're gonna say. I was thinking, well, if we, well, this is kind of weird, but, so remember in, like, a couple of weeks ago, I guess, when we saw the weapon mold thing, if we make a mold into the earth, we can probably make them into a certain shape, maybe into something that, like, will carry itself across the river like a boat shape or something maybe and i could create a raft but it won't last more than three hours or so that would be but then yeah that's perfect if you can create the raft you can probably create the mold for the raft what if right what if we put them on um... the airship and we fold them down mm -hmm. Sorry, what were you going to say, Polly? Uh, I, I just sort of pipe up and um, I'm like, well, I have some experience in carpentry. I have um, tools if I, I didn't know these guys and I don't really know what's happening. But if I can help, um, I, I will. I, I think I... Did I... Am I... And I'm looking through my things. Um, mm -hmm. <clears throat> Satoshi, would three hours be enough for a raft from here to reach the sea, do you think? I, I could assume so. It wasn't that long of a walk from from the beach here, from, um, from where we came. 
Yeah, I think that that, sh that should be that should be fine. And I mean, I could, I could use some of my magic to push it along, to make it go faster. Mm. I have gusts ah. as well. Perfect. We can we can do it together. It will be the fastest way. Hmm. I can just create it now. That seems like a like a good farewell to these these poor folks. They deserved a lot better than what we gave them. Yeah. Ah. Alright. If you wanna, did you wanna build a raft or did you wanna like use your magic to create the raft? Um. How big is something that's medium size? That is uh, five by five. It's not very big. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean Polly can like make one. Like that could be. She oh, you can make a you can make a model uh, that we can <laughs> use as a reference to be able to build the raft. Hmm. What if some Or I could make a stack of wood <laughs> <laughs> I mean yeah Alright Alright then how do you want do you just like essentially create like a five by five cubed pile of wood? <laughs> yes <laughs> Polly, you just point us where where you want us to be, and we'll we'll, we'll get helping. All right. All right. Um, let's get started then. Uh, so I don't know anything about bolt making. Don't you don't actually need to. If you want to roll for me with advantage, okay. do you have carpentry tools in your inventory? Uh, I. Yes, I do. Perfect. You won't need to roll for anything then. You, I. Okay. I'm 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 deciding to homebrew a rule where like if you got the tool, if you got a thing. You and you're um, proficient in it. You won't need to roll for it. You'll you can just do it. Okay. Right. You can build. You just start building at your raft. And actually, roll for me with um, clicking on the proficiency uh, on the uh, um, the carpentry tool or whatever there is uh, with in dexterous or uh, dexterity. We'll see how fast you can build build this raft for me. As uh, Satoshi uh, is just captaining and telling you guys to like help around and like just be like where you need to be to help Polly. As low, could you roll me uh, a d20 and then sorry. a d100? I'm not no, sure what I'm supposed to click. I shall open your sheet for you and have a look. See for if you wanna. So on your sheet, you'll see there's a section, um, tools proficiency and cus uh, custom skills. It's just below passive wisdom. Oh yes. And it will open a drop uh, drop down box, and if you just want to click on dexterity for me. Okay. Thirty. Okay. You are. It's taking. It, it does take a few hours to get going, and like the sun, it, it's about midday by the time you guys finish. No, Nico, you got a fourteen, wasn't it? Mm-hmm. Fourteen, and it was eighty. Mm-hmm. As you guys are working, you see Loniko's skin start to tan. And it just starts... Yeah, it just becomes a fairly light tan. A lot. Um, her skin's normally fairly pale. But yeah, she just suddenly just starts darkening. As you see magic just swirling around. Like l these little specks of magic swirl around her. And uh, she's turning to gold. No, 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 she's not. She's just tan. She's just Are you tanning okay? Right Are you okay, man? Okay. okay. Huh? But you guys you get... need to get out of the sun? Are, is, she, is she getting a sunburn? Uh, guys? Last Wait, time something happened with you, you know, Nico, you went really crazy, so what's happening? Oh, um, no, I think, um, you know, this is, um, the, the wild magic, um, mm. That happened, you know, when it erupted from the ground. There's kind of just well magic everywhere, and I cast a spell to to make the the wood. <clears throat> uh, I think it must just be. I'm sure it'll go back. 
to, to normal. It's not the weirdest thing that's happened to my skin. <laughs> really? Aha. Uh, -huh. uh, uh, no. Okay, we don't have to get into that, but really? Yes. <laughs> what was it? Can we get into that? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we don't have to. Alright, Lothar, stop lollygagging. Put that mask up for me. That's <laughs> the Toshi. What? It's Toshi just <laughs> telling you what to do as you guys are like building the uh, the raft. Because this is ha this has happened just as you guys start building the raft. Ah. Oh, oh, the mask. Oh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So sorry. Yeah, yeah, on it. And Satoshi just gives a little nod to you, Loniko. Give it a little nod back. <laughs> Inside she's like, oh god! <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, your raft takes just a few hours to build, and you guys have a raft now that will... <laughs> Love my boy angry. <laughs> no, it's focused <laughs> 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 thinking a lot. Oh my god. Concentration. Mm. Yeah. yeah, you guys build a raft for the gold, um, the uh, the golden fallen of Kasakawa, and you guys are able to log uh, the box. Are you keeping them in the box or are you taking them all out? Like what's out? Yeah, we're taking, taking them out. out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, you guys just one by one start taking them out, and um, it it is you. It feels very macabre and somber for you, you both. Um, like you, you don't know these people. Look, like you've you've been through a portion of what they've been through uh, in Kasakawa, and like Lofi and Aloniko, you like also get that feeling. Satoshi um, doesn't fully comprehend what's happening, but there is he, like seeing how like just stricken you guys are. That they, they are their expression is just a constant frown, and just trying to be re as reassuring as they can and supportive in this moment with you guys. As they uh, help uh, put on the the golden people on the crate, but you do eventually get it done. It it does spend most the rest of the morning to get it all done. You guys, uh, um, Loniko. Yes. Am I misremembering or I don't know? I don't know. What is it? I, I actually, I don't know if Loniko said this. Did you talk about Kano? Um, like, how much did you talk about Kano and his golden hands? Uh, the golden hands were mentioned. Um, were mentioned. Okay, so you you, you mentioned, uh, like, you know, when you gave the stuff you brought back from the time you weren't exactly there but um because like polly's right next to us and i and i'm not sure how comfortable she would be hearing that then i went anyways. to the other world yeah yeah <laughs> uh, uh so like what happened to the they were kind of golden a bit right uh, well, i guess uh, they I think... were solid gold and and, and... And I made them not solid gold. How and she just kind of shrugs. <laughs> um, I'm not really sure. I touched them and thought about them not being gold, and it just happened. I assume it's because it was in the spirit world, so it was only mm. his spirit. I was affecting. Maybe your fire, your fires just burn stronger than most. Perhaps. You have, have you ever? We've never. Is it worth trying? Heating them up. Well, I'm. I'm not sure what kind of state these people would like to be in, but looking at and like forcefully turning to look at their expressions. They are um, just, yeah, is in shock, fear, anger, pain. 
a wealth it's just a bit of negative emotions. It's just a bit overwhelming seeing them being like this. I, I'm not sure how effective it would be trying to change their state, but I and if it was any one of you here, well, Polly, like, yeah, like, I'm just I don't. If I can keep trying, basically. Yeah. But I'm not sure it'll work here. Trying, trying is enough. That's all we can do after all, right? Hmm. I will go up to a gold statue and put my hands on it, I guess, and just kind of channel magic into my hands and mm. sort of try and replicate what I did. Roll um, for me. A charisma check, and then add your spellcasting modifier on top of it. I'm spellcasting. Uh, do you mean my attack bonus, or just? Yeah, your attack bonus. Yeah. It's plus eight. Mm -hmm. It takes a bit of time for like it you f to like muster it fully. But it, you just, you do feel just like the fire in you just pour from your toes all the way um, and down from your head all the way through your arms and onto where you're holding the statue. And you just see it just start to bubble and melt in your hands and start turning a very vibrant glowing red as it starts to melt. And you do also feel Yuki's hands on top of yours as you can see. Um, them just appear beside you um spectrally though so like no one else can see them this time but they're holding on to onto your hands as well and adding to the fire as as uh, the is statue it, is melting is it just melting there's nothing underneath nothing underneath just solid gold all the way through okay i'm gonna pull my hands away just sort of turn around and look at low five away. Um, Goodness. So tall she just moans. Is there... Is there a symbol or shape, Ronico, that you know of that symbolizes like peace in passing or maybe a flower shape even I don't know like something that we can so that they can become something else even in death I don't know these are their bodies look like boy their spirits I, I know. Already moved on, but spider lilies are usually used for parting. I will say, Alonika, when you did touch the spirit, you, you and you burnt away at it. You couldn't sense the spirit inside anymore, mm. and you can yeah, you can. You're certain the spirits that were in this box have successfully passed on. Mm. The spirits have already passed on, Mofi Boy, but I can say another prayer as we send the raft off. Okay. But yeah, although, like, the raft. Sorry, go on. No, don't worry. I'll say, like, the raft does sink a bit under the weight, but it does. There is some buoyancy to it. You can argue that the wood is magical and that is adding to the buoyancy. <laughs> because I don't know how physics works. <laughs> how heavy gold actually is. It's very we, heavy. I know. I assume it's much. It's, <laughs> it's bouncing. It's bouncing. It's okay. It's bouncing. It's doing its darndest. So Toshi is just preparing to cast Gust uh, when you're, after you finished your, your prayer. Is it like far away? 
away already? I mean, or yeah, if, is if it you. Just like on the, it, it'd, be, it'd be like right here. Like, if you guys wanted to, like, I pushed it off, you guys can have started pushing it. Can I run to it and, like, put a seed in it? Yeah, you can. You can put a seed in it before, like, you uh, put a seed on it before you. The waters aren't shallow, though. Get careful out there. Like, they, it, it, it's it, just... it steepens very quickly. I would allow you to put a flower on. Um. Before, like, you guys pushed out, and you guys, you put a broke okay. flower seed onto the, which, uh, is a, which you know to grow into this simple purple flower that yeah, it's a simple purple flower that it's a bit simple in its Compared to a lot of the other flowers that you have seeds for, but um, it's it's still very nice. Can I join just... Satoshi in casting gust? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you both can just start casting. You as you start casting gust, they they will cast gust of uh, gust of wind instead. Um, so theirs is slightly stronger, but like together you. You're like he like uh, sorry when like you cast gust they like push their spell into yours, and together you feel uh, their strength um, guiding you as well, and you just the the raft just goes and it just as as you're are you are you praying that you're doing this as well? Or? Uh, yeah, she would have been sort of doing the prayer just sort of before when they were pushing it off. <laughs> you're like. They wouldn't, they'd almost like be like uh, almost taking over your spell as you're doing the prayer, just so like you're not f needing to focus on it. But they, 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 you hear them pray along with you as the raft makes its way down the river out to uh, south, out to sea. And uh, it no longer is uh, visible by the time your prayer ends. And let's give you a little, uh, they give you a bow. Come, I think we should, we should, we should probably leave. Make our way. I was like, wait, where did you go? <laughs> <laughs> she starts cutting at the trees. Exactly. What are you doing? It's just so where, sad. Where is he? <laughs> He's down, sir. Daryl for damage. You don't need to roll for damage. You just start hacking and cutting at this tree, and this tiny little peach blossom. All you just see its peaches. Oh my god, I forgot the peaches. You just see all the peaches just dropping off of it as you just cut it in half completely with your sword, and you you Can see I your wild apple? magic. Yeah, of course, yeah. You see your wild magic just surge aggressively and to almost like spin like a saw blade as you start just cutting away at the tree and completely fell it. Uh, I was just yeah. imagining if it was you guys. I don't want to imagine that. I, I just don't want to imagine that. You don't need to. Come on, we should get moving. We'll lose the rest of the light. As you, as you do that, Lofi boy. You see, uh, and as the tree like falls, you see like one of the peach spirits, a little yellow spirit, push out of it, uh, and then swirl around you, and you feel your flowers drink in the spirit, and then they bloom just a bit more. Um, they, they present themselves more and like push towards the sunlight that's peeking through the canopy of the trees. As you have, uh, as Vix has redeemed for whom the bell tolls, bell flowers toll, and now you can cast your any of your druid magic spells um, mm. as a bonus action instead of an action for the next five uh, turns. <laughs> so then, okay, yeah, um, 
You have to save your anger and your need for need for this for our enemies, Lo-Fi Boy. I'm gonna take a peach that fell, put it on the stump of the tree, mm -hmm. and cast Druidcraft on it. Oh. To try to like fuse the seed, the seedling sapling mm -hmm. with the the stump that I cut. Yeah. You don't need a roll for that, do you? It just kind of happens, doesn't it? Mm. As you start casting Druidcraft, you you feel your like the wild magic that like f surged off your sword swirl around the peach and the tree stump, and you can see it kind of like curve inwards towards the peach to create like a shield around it. As you can see, a little sprout just peak out of the um, out of the peach, and then just grow into a very small sapling but it's it'll grow into a strong peach uh, blossom one day okay you're right I'm I'm back now I let's go she'll just take his hand for a moment and squeeze it and then let's stop Uh, chat, could someone roll for me a d6, please? Lack As... a d6, lack a d6. <laughs> please, I won't get sued. <laughs> I will I'm do not, the suing. I'm, I'm not that good. It don't matter. You're amazing. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Tell him. Ooh, tell him. So now we would cross the Third river, the right? Um, you guys want to cross the river? moving west? Mm, there was... There is still... Um... Many it was an easier crossing this way, wasn't there? Yeah. There's a way further up here. Come on, everyone. If you want, Polly, you can roll a... Um, if you could for me, roll a history check to see if you remember a your, 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 your path. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Polly, you're a genius. <laughs> I guess I do. <laughs> Uh, yeah, actually, um, you know, something about that really sad and heartbreaking, um, the funeral with you guys really jogged my memory. Um, mm -hmm. I'll just send it to you. Uh, I, I remember really crossing a bridge that's that. further north if you keep going right. Uh, what I remember. Um, we keep going right? Uh, yes, north. If no, we keep going right, yeah, there's right. a there's a bridge to the north. I do remember coming across that. Um, so maybe we could, we could head that way. That's great. Come on, everyone. Hold on. How, I, wait, 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 wait. Ignore, <laughs> ignore what I just said. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm like, what a sentence. You guys don't have to worry about that, though. We we have bridges right, now you, to cross. Now, now, you, now you can. I had to change a thing. Bridges oh. to burn. Oh, I, I see. Um, but th see, there was this small issue with um, the bridge. There, uh, I really, geez, I don't know how to say this. There was a watermelon man, <laughs> um, and he wanted to fight me at the bridge. Uh, he did let me cross. It was kind of, it was weird. Uh, it was really weird. But uh, maybe look out for the Polly? watermelon man. Paul, yeah. we have a saying back where I come from. Mm -hmm. uh, well, one people might call a problem, we call an opportunity. So let's get at it. As you say yeah, that, low five boy. Man is an opportunity. <laughs> As you say that, <laughs> low five boy, roll me a d20 <laughs> and then a d100. So that would be 6 and 24. Yep. Wait, you guys can keep going? Okay. I don't really know where we're going. This way? Okay. Oh, right, I boy. Wrong thing. If anything is Everybody wearing... Had a different way. I don't know where to go. <laughs> <laughs> I thought we were going right. 
<laughs> Polly over here. <laughs> I'm, I'm coming. I definitely nice. remember. <laughs> <laughs> definitely so remember. So we're going to this this way north. We're going this way. Yeah, this is north is going west. Uh, is like following the right. Um, no, aren't we supposed to be moving west? Yeah, west is up. These branches oh, definitely north. they look familiar. Oh, but there's a bridge. Okay, oh, I understand. No. What? Folks, As you up, up at the river, there's. I point. I point to these crates at the river. Oh, crate. <laughs> As you see those crates, you hear something. Uh, low five ways. Oh, that's the bridge! Right. Before you... <laughs> <laughs> Good eye, Lo Nico. Good eye. Before, before you do anything, just give me a second. Look, uh, <laughs> okay. Low five boy. anytime you see anything wearing black, you have advantage on your charisma checks against it. Anything that wears charisma. white, charisma. Anything wearing white, you have disadvantage on their charisma. Both. Hello. <laughs> uh, there's what about... It's it's fine if they're wearing both. This doesn't apply. Okay. I'm... And okay. As you see that spirit around you that was on the peach uh, uh, blossom. Yeah. It pushes off you. You still feel the magic resonating off it, but then you see it flying towards Randall. And it gives you a chat inspiration, as Randall, uh, Vix has gifted you a chat inspiration. Thank you, Vix. Um, when you l s mention that you see that bridge, you hear something coming from those crates. Oy. What's this about crates? Something like groaning. Oh, come on. Something groaning as it's trying to climb out of the water. As you see a mechanical hand reach. Uh, oh! <laughs> I don't even know where this is. Like, like deadpan face, and just go around the corner here. Huh? Yep, that's uh. Everything good there, Randall? The yeah. Sure. You don't look. You don't look so good. Uh, uh, I've never heard your voice be so high pitched before, like this. It's, Mr. Uh, Randall, did you see something? As, who can see Dan? Uh, like around this. Come your gray tongue. I saw it. I saw it, but I. I, I can only see I, it here. Oh, I can see it. Oh you no. You can see a few more crawling out of the few? water. Rocky backs up well. a little bit. How about? How about we just call it here? I think it's yeah. good. Um, oh, I can see now. Hey, <laughs> here forever. How about like watermelons? I'll be frank with you. Okay, how uh, how bad is the river like going? Like, is it like it's rapid? -y? Not rapid, but like it's it, it like it will, will try to like you might get to, if you aren't the best swimmer, it will take you. Is that, there... this is the only crossing? What about the shallow place we just swore, like, and yeah. spent, like, give me, give me a second. Day. Yeah. It wasn't that shallow, was it? it yeah, it wasn't. Might have been a better way than this. <laughs> I mean, we can cut a tree and cross with a tree or something. I don't know. Won't that make a lot of noise? I could make something, but only five foot. <laughs> you know, the bridge, um, I'm not, I'm not entirely sure that it is the bridge. It is certainly a bridge. Um, so we can move along there. Okay, that sounds like a good idea. Yeah, let's... Okay, let's go. Okay. Can, you guys can, move can we try to be quiet? Um, can I stealth? Yeah, you can roll stealth. Satoshi oh, there's does, a fella. Satoshi does look when you, when you roll there's stealth. There's a little fella. And starts sneaking. <laughs> Freaking... I'm going along these trees in these bushes. If you guys give me a moment, I'll get to you guys in a hot second too. <laughs> Satoshi, holy moly! As I see Satoshi walk down there and no. trips on a twig. Oh no, Satoshi! As Polly and Lofi Boy have already rushed in. As you hear the jittering and japery of some shibatan. Just minding their business, eating the peaches on the ground. And you can hear the heavy thudding of Those are a our threat, peaches. A crate of Shabbaton that lurks around the corner. <laughs> Give me a second, I'll put it in there. 
All right, Lofa boy, you hold on a second. Go back two I'm paces. Officially lost sight of Lofa boy. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, we have to click restart on him. <laughs> two paces, you said, right? Okay. Where's the HP gone? It's disappeared for me. I see it. I'm I can see it. Fine. As long as you guys can see, it's fine then. Um, but yeah, Lofa boy, you're standing. Can I enter a rage? I'm so. You can. This. I can. You can. I I will. I am. I I enter rage. Mhm. Mm Damn it! Like, bruh. <laughs> bruh. <laughs> like right now, I'm like. Uh, so fight boy at the beginning was just thinking, okay, um, new kind of warforge. How bad could that be? The same kind of box that. No 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 no. And then, oh, they didn't no. climb out of the box. They're like they're dripping wet, and like they look like they're scratched up, damaged, and just falling apart. And now, yeah, like uh, now I'm just like, then these yokai again. That you know, never we just were just chilling in a nice, beautiful peach forest, uh, trying to deal with emotions. And then these people, things, and I just, uh, yeah, no, enter rage, and basically my flowers that were already blooming from before, like, mm -hmm. in an angry um, energy, just start uh, creating this, like, seed of concentrated magic that starts... Uh, shooting, uh, what's written in the thing mm -hmm. there, so... Five magic missiles. So if you want to roll for me five d4s. As your flowers just pew, 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 pew. <laughs> one, one, three, three. So basically how this works is you can, like, put, like, one dice on as many, like, you've got five, basically, damage dice there. You can put them on, like, as many things as you want, but you only get to, like, spend, like, like one dice per thing, if that makes sense. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, I understand what you mean. Yeah, cool. Like, you can so, split the damage across what you Right. See. I am going to concentrate it all on uh, this tree here mm -hmm. so that it falls and, and, like, I'm trying to make it so that it falls and goes, like, across, like... I, I feel like um, I don't know how much my sound is precise or accurate, but it always I have a, it's perfect. Like the aim is perfect. So what I want is that I want to try to make the tree fall like this. Okay. Yeah, you are able to. Hmm. You start chipping away at the wood, and yeah. but this one is a lot thicker than the one you were trying to cut down earlier. So you only yeah. get just about halfway through. But like, okay. it, like it could go based on whatever force is pushed into it. Yeah. Uh, that force will be me. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and I will go at it. Uh, no time to waste for uh, feeling the the shape of the sword today. Just standard sword and shield attack. Um, trying to uh, create what I've described before. And, and yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's and, it. Uh, as I'm cutting at it, I'm gonna say, everyone, just come across this side, and I swing right into the little dent that I made before. Mm. You, yeah, you just hear as like Lofa Boy shouts across to you guys. You hear just the crash of a tree falling as like peaches go flying everywhere, and, uh, white flowers just start like falling off of the tree. As there is now a. Uh, um, a barricade created by Lofi Boy on this, um, separating these two sides. Give me a second as I do this. Can I, does it, do the, do the ACU units notice that? Roll for me a perception. Uh. See if you notice that they noticed it. Oh no, a 12. 12. You, you're in your just haste. You haven't got a chance to like see 
focus on them right now. It's like you just see this tree just suddenly fall. Um, anything else, Lofi boy? Uh, does the uh, thing of like being able to cast a yeah, bonus action apply during rage? Yeah, no, yeah, even even during rage. Okay, because it's the chat thing. Awesome. And so what I will do is I will place my hands uh, onto the fallen tree and try to use it as a catalyst to cast Entangle oh. uh, on the other side. Yeah. Uh, but like using like the tree and like its branches to kind of like grab uh, at what's around, I guess, mm -hmm, if mm -hmm. that makes sense. Yeah, no, I, I'm, and, I'm digging it. And so uh, I just want to see again the range of that. I'm going to put it's it in chat 20 in a second. I, right. I think so as well. It's a... Uh, square. That's also the the thing. Awesome. So if you wanted like so, yeah, yeah, like, like that. that. Perfect. Yep, yep, yep. And as soon as that tree collapses, you just see roots. Oh, not roots. The branches bend and twist as wild magic just swirls around it and throws itself. Like the branches, like just extend and grow into like these aggressive vines that look identical to uh, Lofi Boy's flowers, sprouting off of the branch and the wood and the bark as it just splinters and twists and just morphs around uh, his wild magic and just grow um, around uh, this area completely covering the floor and like up to about like their like uh, eye level of um, well I say eye level they've got too many eyes um, <laughs> all over the Shabbat and they're gonna have to roll a uh, dexterity save or a strength save that is a strength save thank you Shabbat and Eleven and nineteen. Right. Uh, we. Uh, so th the spell save DC for that is it with my own like uh, intelligence or something? It I, is. It is against your own spell slave. So whatever your barbarian spell slave thing is, we'll do that for now. Oh, that would be 18, 18? my barbarian thing. All right, the, right. This Shaban succeeds, but the one closest fails. And that gets completely entangled, but the other one's trying like leaping and climbing over the vines and the and the branches. Cool. Anything else you'd like to do? Uh, no, just like uh, stay there and then uh, holding it, concentrating. That's yes. it. All right, it is now. Who do you want to pass it to? Um, I'm going to pass it to um, the... I actually only see... You know what? I'm going to do this. And you, like, through the trees and vines and branches, I only see Satoshi and the other um, yokai. So I'm going to pass <laughs> it to uh, the yokai right in front of me. Uh, <laughs> that didn't get... Mm. You're a brave uh, yep. man, Sam. <laughs> Alright, this, this yokai is going to try and break free from its restraints. 10 failing, so it's still stuck. This one leaps out, and seeing Polly charges towards her, and just starts screaming as it's swinging its club, trying to get you. Oh god. Does a 17 hit? Yeah, you see. <laughs> uh, <laughs> AC is 14, so uh, yeah, yeah, it does. You take a seven bludgeoning as it just like you could, like just panic as it comes rushing at you, and you just like get just it's you go to duck as it just s smashes into it. Are you still rebarbering low? Oh god, um, I don't know I just, what health Polly is at. <laughs> I can't see Polly's health. She is at. 33 out of 26. If you guys want, I can do this. Give me a second. Can you guys see it now? Oh, wait. It, it uh, I can see there. the bar. I just see the bar, yeah. Not the number, but I that? see the silvery bar. Sorry, I thought, oh. you were, I thought you were silvery bob in there. Like, I saw you typing on the bar. No, I, 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 I have to use the spell slot right, for that. Um, not to worry. Now I'm not going to. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you just duck and it, you just feel its club smash and like skim past your um, and brush past your like uh, the uh, ribbon on your uh, bandana and tied on your head, and you just like 
have just this dread fill your entire body as it completely just um, drains you in just like by just even just like rushing up to you. Um, it's going to pass its turn over to the Greater Shabbaton, which is going to do something funky. It's going to charge on. through the tree. It's going to just... You, like, you... This tree doesn't exist anymore, so you just see this Greater Shabbaton just blast through whatever trees <clears throat> were there and, like, the remaining of the stump and roots and just smash into you, low fi boy. If I... Does it ever click to get a little, little bit into the... It does not. Entangled. No, it doesn't. Okay. No, it does. I'm Smarter than I thought. It does. It does. It does. Yeah. Well. Just give me some. You the plus. I think it's just plus two. So that would be. Ah. Uh, yeah, it's just plus two. It, so it, it gets nine. Nine, Sam. Nine. What? The strength save. Yeah, the strength save. Yeah, it fails. It. it, it yeah. Like not its little foot that it stepped into the square, like gone. Not to worry, because no, it's <laughs> not to worry, because it would still be in range to hit you with this two ham, two-handed warhammer as it just Jeez. smashes Jeez. down onto you as it charges through the woods and seventeen. So, hit. Uh, with one hand I'm concentrated on the spell, with the other one I stop his hit. Oh, here you thinking it's slick. <laughs> Could you roll me a strength save? Of course. Uh, as I'm like uh, holding back against it, my flowers and everything are like pulsating um, mm -hmm. as I'm clicking on the strength save. Oh, thank you, Iskra, for the follow. Oh, also, um, we'll get, well, I'll get to that in a second. With your strength save, yeah, you are you are able to just like catch it and just keep it in place, and you just yeah, you're holding onto its hammer as it's trying to smash down onto you. Its push into you though is still enough force to just deal a bit of damage. You take only four because you're raging, uh, but it is yeah. pushing into you with its huge, furry, um, just. It's like like I like I'd almost describe it like it's a like a mutated rhino is the way I would describe what the Greater Shaban is like with just the, its ferocity as it charges into you. Um, I kind of sigh in disappointment. Were you able to catch it? Yeah. But yeah, and as you catch it, you just see Yuki leap uh, out of your uh, third eye on your mask uh, low in in their fox form, and you guys can see uh, Yuki in their fox form just leap out. And stand in a guard position in front of Lo. Uh -oh. oh, I'm ready to protect. <laughs> As I shout, thank you, Bix, for summoning Yuki, my best thank boy. Thanks. And it is now. Uh, it's going to pass its turn over to who can the Greatest Shabbat and see. It'll pass it over to uh, Satoshi. Actually, no, I'm not going to. Sorry, I'll pass it over to Lo. Lo, it's your turn. Okay. Um. Uh, cool. I'm going to cast Sacred Flame on the Shaban that's in the Entangle. Because mm -hmm. it does radiant damage. Mm. And he has to succeed on a dex save. Dex save? On which Without one is with disadvantage. Uh, which one? Are you, are you hitting this one here? Uh, yeah, that one there. In there. Yeah, they'd, they'd have disadvantage on the deck save. Sorry, so, I don't know why no, that went twice. I that's okay. That. <laughs> I meant to put it in chat. It fails. Taking 14 damage. And like as soon as like it just, your fire like pours... How are you, how are you casting your sacred uh, flame? Um, she'll probably... Um, play a song but it will like come from like her bells will glow slightly um, on her mask um, and she would like point her pick towards the little fella mm -hmm. Yuki also like when you when you got to point Yuki also just gets into a little ready stance as well as your fires uh, pour off of him and like or like pull away at his uh, tail fires and just surge outwards from your shamisen and your pick and then as they just you see them burn at the branches and, and light and like lo-fi boy from where you are you can see 
the Shaban catches like it like full on and like through like little gaps within the vines you see light pouring out as the fire surges around that area completely disintegrating that yokai and i'm gonna say some of the damage does carry over to the other yokai as well because they're right there but you, you destroyed that uh that one that shibata um i'm going to give a bird inspiration uh i'll give one to polly um polly you and then i got to figure out what I'm doing with Yuki. Uh, <laughs> uh, Yuki will healing word Polly. Mm -hmm. If you want to cast healing word Randall, could you roll me a d20 and then a d100 please? And then... Come on. Could Lofa Boy, could you roll me a d20 and then a d100 as well? Uh, 14 on the D20 and 85 on the D100. Perfect. Um, I will get to that in a second. As you see, as a, like, so coming off of a Lonico's Sacred Flame, you see a, you just see this little yellow and purple fox leap off of, um, off of uh, Lonico's Sacred Flame and swirl around you for a moment, Rocky, gifting you from Frankie, a chat inspiration. Um, let me just do the, let me just do the thing. So, what did you get on yours? Uh, first one, uh, uh, first D twenty roll. Uh, Rocky, uh, Randall. Uh, fourteen. Perfect. What was the next one? Eighty-five. 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 Pick a creature. Any creature. Any creature. Any creature. Tyrannosaurus Rex. No, no not that you. On, on the map you think, Don. That you can see. That you can see. Sorry, sorry. That was, that was my fault. Sorry. That, that, that was purely on me. Sorry. I was like, motherfucking T Rex, let's go. Sorry, that was, that was, that was, that was, that was on me. I gotta go, I gotta go clip that. Sorry, that was too big. Oh no. Th this guy? Perfect, it gets a plus one on its attack. Fuck. Sorry. Any uh and then uh you got a one and then a three, didn't you, Lofi Boy? Lofi Boy? Sam! Yeah, so far away. <laughs> Did you get a one and a three? I got one. Yeah. You have become suddenly deaf. That's why. Hey, welcome to the club. Back. Welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Lofi boy, you can you will not be able to hear for a whole day. Okay. I'm gonna put this on just so like you know like that means that is headphones and zero means you are deaf. This gets a Lofi plus Lofi boy. Hey Lofi boy, why is he ignoring just, me? Uh, hey Lofi boy. Like when it's oh, my rude. turn, just do this. Honestly, <laughs> I don't want to travel with him anymore if he's just gonna ignore me suddenly. All uh, right, it is um. Anything else you want to do, Lo? Sorry. Yes. Uh, I'm going to use Yuki and cast. Uh, he knows all the spells I know, right? Every yep. And he upcasts them to yep. max uh, whatever the highest level. Cool. You um, I'm gonna have him cast Sacred Flame on the one in front of Polly. He's gonna do it. So that one needs to make a dex save. Mm -hmm. That'll do it. Oh no, it doesn't. Sorry, my mistake. It succeeds. My spell save DC is 16. I Never mind, it does not. <laughs> it just immediately turns into just ash and white dust as you you tear at it. You just hear it just give the faintest of shrieks and glitching as it distorts away. Um, Polly, you are now safe for a moment. <laughs> I can like protect you too, to Yuki Shanks. I'm like, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> you are most welcome. Anything else you'd like to do? Uh, you also have I your phone section. I can move, actually. Yeah, I've moved. Um, mm. I can't do anything for my bonus section. I'm just going to move up here. Does so Yuki still get a bonus section spell as well? Or did he do uh, I I cast Healing Word. It was 10. Okay. Um, Sorry. Mom's sick. 10 right. for Polly. Polly, you have gained 10 healing as well as like Yuki sings to you. 
What a beautiful song. Thank you. Well, Nico told me. We're gonna be mad about it. <laughs> His head just grows huge when you say that. <laughs> I will pass it to uh, Rocky. Let's go! Sorry, needed to add uh, mm -hmm. uh, no a, a bit of food in my mouth. Um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Sam's actually deafened himself. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's funny. He's not going to know when to undeafen himself, though. Yeah. I guess you put it in the chat, but uh, nah. anyways, so he's, he's said <laughs> to do this, So let's see if it works. Let's see if this works. Do what though? Like, like what did he tell? Oh, ping him. Do this, ready? ready? Like, ping him, ping him. Ready? Let's uh. see if it actually brings it. Oh, up. oh, it's my turn. No. <laughs> <laughs> Is it? I'm gonna yeah. listen myself just to hear you guys. You did, you did great. You did great, Sam. You did great. Yeah, you doing so great. Oh, was it my you. turn? No. no. We, we just want to test if the system was gonna work. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Awesome, awesome. It did. Cool, cool. 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 Right, For a moment, time. I just hear you guys, and then and then I don't anymore. <laughs> <laughs> what would you like to do, Rocky? Oh. Okay, I'm gonna first run up 30 feet, which is here. Mm -hmm. uh, this is the last yokai I see, right? This big boy. Yeah. Is he in a tree? What What is he doing? He is not in the tree. He is like just charged straight at Lofi Boy. Lofi Boy is holding him uh, back by the hammer. Okay, and what is this brown wall thing going on here? This that thing? is a tree that's fallen over. That like Lofi Boy. Okay. That's right. All right. Um, so I thought he was being smart, but he wasn't actually as smart as I thought. It still was cool, but like I was like, this isn't. I thought he was. I thought he was doing a little path that you guys go through. Nah, he just wanted to fight. If uh, if uh, if Lo-Fi Boy gets deafened by a yokai and a tree falls in a forest, does it make a sound? <laughs> um. <laughs> anyways, so I have. Um, <laughs> sorry, I read. <laughs> I, I, this is a little bit of a tangent, real quick. So, so uh, <laughs> Georgia, Georgia uh, or Lonico put something in the chat saying, "Sam, you dumb bitch," and I just thought I thought it said, "Are you a dumb bitch?" I thought that's what it was, and I, I for a split second, I thought that was referencing me, and I was like, "What in the world?" I thought Georgia was bullying me for a second. Uh, anyways, no, I'm just bullying. That's that's fine. That's just. Uh, that's that's uh that's acceptable. Okay, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Socially acceptable. Even. How can how far? I, I assume I can't reach ten feet. Um, you, I, I guess you have. You, yeah, I don't. You have the reach. You have your bows. Yeah, but I'm not about to shoot ten feet away. Um, if I I need my gun. Uh, <laughs> so I can I can use my bonus action to move a little bit more though. You right? can yes, but it is a uh, difficult terrain. I uh, I actually I think I have a thing for difficult terrain. Oh shit, yo! Uh, give me a split <laughs> second. I haven't been able to use it at all so far, so I have to. You should. I have earth. I have earth walk, which uh, oh! allows me to move across difficult terrain made of earth or stone without expending extra movement. Nah, this this is this is branch difficult terrain, Salisbury. That's earth. <laughs> what do you mean? What the heck? <laughs> earth this or grass stone? type. This ain't rock type. <laughs> I did, but I can still move, right? What yeah, does that mean? See, no, yeah, you just, it just becomes five feet becomes ten feet. What you cut out? Five feet becomes ten feet. Okay, well, I mean, either way, I don't, I don't plan on expending all of my bonus yeah. movement right now. Anyway, so uh, I just, I, I my short is I use my bonus action, and now I'm here. That's mm -hmm. uh, all I need to know. Um, and so now I can still use my attacks. Am I the last to go this round? Nope. Or no, no. I haven't gone yet. Holly, Randall, and Satoshi so. haven't gone. Okay. No, oh, dang. Well, but anyways, I was gonna pass myself. That was it. But uh, I'm gonna still use my my first attack and my my second attack, but I don't get my bonus attack. And I have inspiration right now. It seems for some yep, reason. You do. All right. Frankie gave it to you. Uh, oh, thank you, Frankie. I must have zoned out for that part, uh, or been downstairs during then. Um. Okay. First attack. That is that a 23 to hit. I sure hope so. Be really upset if not. 13 damage. <laughs> Thane does it. Thane, Thane's cleaving at the the, the Great Shabbat as it just shrieks and roars. Oh, okay. As it's trying to swipe at your hand as you're cutting at it, cleaving chunks out of its body. Cool. Um, so it's... Is it dead? It, so it's... No, no, no. It's still, it's still alive. Sorry. Oh, 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 sorry. So you said 13 does it, and for a split second, I was like... Oh, sorry, okay. that, that's on me. That's on me. Okay, and then my second attack... Uh... Uh... I, I would do this. That is 18 to hit. 18 hits. Hit. Okay. That is four, six damage. <laughs> Roll to one. Love that. 
Yeah, no, it's, it's just still trying to catch your katana as you're just slashing at it. Hmm. Okay. Um, and then I guess that's the end of my turn. I will pass it to... So I have Polly, Randall, and... Um, Satoshi, yeah. Satoshi. <clears throat> I will pass it to... Randall's the only one I can really see. I'll pass it to Randall. Randall, your turn. Uh, I'm going to turn... Man. <laughs> and a wink. <laughs> I pull it into my heart. Uh, I turn to Satoshi and say, could you keep an eye on those uh, those ACU units that popped out? Those are the... I don't know if you know what those are, but those are those robots that just popped out of there. Aye, aye, Captain. Thanks so much. 15, 20, 25, 30. All right, okay. Rocky, you know what to do. Strike hard, strike true. And I will give you my like uh, advantage with the help action. I think we said that was a feather? Yep. Yeah, feather. Yeah. Who are you giving it to? Uh, to Rocky. And that'll be my turn. Are you not shooting nothing I'll else? Pass it to, yeah, I'll pass it to Polly. All right, Polly, what would you like to do? Get up in the fight with us. <laughs> okay. Um. W uh. With the thing that I'm supposed to tell a be of any help here. You can cast Bardic Inspiration. You have a few spells that might be able to do damage, or you can heal someone if they need healing. Okay. Um. Crap. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't feel like there's anything useful, you can like hold your action. So, oh, like if someone needs healing, and then do uh... it then, or like you can move as well. Just come close to me. I don't fully trust you yet, so stay close. <laughs> come here. I don't trust you. <laughs> Just keep no, his enemies close. Far away. <laughs> Get closer so you can stab me in the back. What? Huh? Um. Uh. Well, I've I already can't had someone do that to me. I I will sense oh. it coming this time. <laughs> I'm going to move so I can see what the heck is happening. Um panic as I realize oh god <laughs> that thing is huge uh, and I will I sure will do something um I'll, I guess I'll... Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be of much use. <laughs> I'm not very strong. Uh, I just I could... That's okay. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Kill him! Single hand. Uh, <laughs> you don't think you got him, anything got else it. to do? You, you can't you can just pass your turn on to Satoshi. Uh, you know what? I might... I'll just do a little bardic inspiration because I that's the only thing I think I can do. How do you wanna do how do you wanna inspire? Uh I'm going to get my do 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 my the instrument that I have, my kalimba, and with very shaky, very shaky uh fingers, play a little ditty, uh and Give Bardic Inspiration to... Uh... Randall. Alright, thank you! And then, and then I guess, I then I guess I'm... You know what? Yeah, I, I'm done. <laughs> There's nothing I can do! I'm done. I'm out. <laughs> Not to worry. Bye! As you, as you do that, um... You can only pass it over to Satoshi, so it's they're gonna. What they're gonna do is, um, they're getting closer. They're very close. <laughs> they're just around the corner. Oh <laughs> they, no! You they can't. Around. They're right there. Oh god. As Satoshi, um, looking at like what to do, seeing you guys there, seeing him here, he just starts looking at his spells. <laughs> <laughs> I can hold him off, I'll try. You're right around there, Captain. I got it, you <laughs> have. You guys just keep going, I'll, I'll, I'll keep him back. Alright, just give me a second, I've got to roll and a strength that's him check. Dying. That's the sound <laughs> of Satoshi dying, is what that was. As you, you just hear a sudden oh my rush God, that's horrifying. of explosive wind. 
um, oh, no. burst from Satoshi as you see his uh, their hair become this torrential wave, and it grows wildly long in these like just waves curling and swarming over each other as just this blast of wind uh you see just buffet the trees as well and you see some of the trees even like bend and twist at the force of their gust of wind um i just need to find the acu units ac units as they're called air conditioning units units it's just, you, they're AC units, yeah, they, mm. they blow cold air at us, That's, they're not that threatening. I wish. As you <laughs> just hear this just force of wind push back and cause the ground to like get dug up as you hear a metal scratching against rock, as you hear the glitching and distortion as one of the AC units, you, you can't see much of it, you can just about see through the trees. Um, one of the AC units get pushed back, but the others are trying to like climb and pull their way through the gust of wind. Satoshi has just um, pushed outwards. Um, they're going to pass their turn to Randall. Rando! <clears throat> Marlon <Yeah>. Rando. <laughs> this is and I can yeah. jump up on top of this log, right? Yeah. Okay. And I will take my slash at the big boy. Mm -hmm. Oh, slash crap, at I did not boy. add. Oh, I saw I just do that with damage. 17 hits. 17 hits. Beauty. That is 18 damage on him. Perfect. I just like jump up the tree and just like run down it like Naruto mm. style and like mm. slash up him. Yeah, no, you like it, it doesn't even expect you come in. And you are just like a shadow in the wind as you just start cleaving at one of its, at its other arm that is tr uh, trying to catch uh, Rocky's katana. And it just completely gets Shh. thrown aside as with that too, mm. you you can hear something. Uh, everyone roll me a perception check, please. Even even Sam? No, oh, actually, he's not even listening. No, he oh, wait, he, it, so he can't yeah, hear. Oh, sense. yeah, he can't hear, yeah. But he, he, oh, Lord. <laughs> How do I manage to lose this every single time? <laughs> I must have wax in my ear. Perception. Or there you are, perfect. <laughs> Low Randall uh, Satoshi also will need to roll one. Oh, but but he's cheating. Sam, Sam can't even. Sam no, can't no, hear. No. You listen to the stream. I know it, but also <laughs> that's not fair because you can't. Yeah, like that's that's that means nothing. Yeah. Do that with disadvantage, Sam. But disadvantage. So, but he got a nat twenty. It's so funny. That nat twenty was wasted on this on the deaf boy trying right. to listen. To something. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna listen to this. Thing. You hear? Right. Roll with disadvantage, you numpty. You... With disadvantage. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, you... but I got a nat twenty. Yeah, <laughs> 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 What's the other one? What the f- What? <laughs> I was watching, look, I noticed Satoshi turned. Um... Uh, <laughs> I think, ran on- uh, across the tree or something. Um... I <laughs> wait, wait for- I'm-, I'm <laughs> Jesus. When my turn's over, you'll know, you'll know. When you- Would you- everyone- the only person that like doesn't perceive this is Rocky. You're too focused on finding the Shabbaton and getting just caught yeah. off by surprise by uh, Randall, uh, Naruto running down this uh, log of wood. You guys all look <laughs> up <laughs> through the canopy, ex and except for Lofa Boy as well. You don't see shit because you can't hear ah, it. Okay. You 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 aren't okay. able to see because like you guys can hear these heavy mechanical footsteps pushing through the trees, bending and twisting the wood as. Very far away, but it's very loud from where you guys are. Even even from where you guys are. And you can just see through the canopy this giant white mechanical beast of a be uh, uh, humanoid creature pushing through the canopy. Um, Randall, you recognize it as one of the mechs being built at Kasakawa. You can see it scratched what? up, smashed and broken in a bunch of places. You can only just about see the heads and shoulders of it smashed and cut away and scratched away as you can hear just it make this mechanical moan as it's just trying to 
push through and just call for something as it's searching and just just pushing oh, through and you just hear it just, <laughs> just <laughs> making its way to making its way south which is the direction you guys currently are in uh, I'm gonna also with my, my bonus action since uh, Rockio still has my my help action I'm going mm -hmm. to use the uh, the uh, disengage mm -hmm. just get behind just get behind Rocky go ahead could you want to pass it over to right. Uh, right. I, and then I will jump crazily in the air to looking at Lo-Fi Boy, getting his attention and passing it to him. <clears throat> All right. Uh, so, uh, does he feel the vibrations of the noise at least? Yeah, or like, like I'd say, yeah, you you feel the vibrations traveling through okay. the band because uh, it is like even from its distance it is <clears throat> monstrous okay um um i, I seeing a, a, a randall not at me i'm not back um taking my oh, hands I'm off i'm jumping at you like crazy like my arms okay, are like okay, okay, and okay. i'm like you <laughs> dude Okay, um, I'm going to, and the, the creature thing was north, so it would be in this direction, right? Give me a second. Which direction? Uh, if I'm not mistaken, north is over this way, yeah, right? Yeah, it's far, like it's far away, but it's yeah, like... Yeah, yeah, okay, okay, okay. Um, so I, I will untang, well, stop the concentration of... of Entangle, I think. Um, how bad is this uh, Shabbaton looking? The big one. Roll insight. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Insight. 12. You. It looks like it's getting on, but it's not like it's not neat. It's not there yet. Okay. Um. So sorry. What I'm gonna do uh, is uh, well, I'm gonna go towards the the stump of the tree, I suppose, if I if I may. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, right. <laughs> okay. But, yeah. Thanks. Um, and I will. Uh, I guess try to. Uh, I, I just want to see very, very, very quickly. I'm gonna like hit it first with. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, I haven't done this in a long time. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Okay. <laughs> so the first thing I'm gonna do is just hit it with the uh, the sword. If mm -hmm. if my that if hits. aim is true. All Your right. Is... And so I'm aiming at the foot that it had like outside of uh, the entangle thing. Mm -hmm. Um, which probably would have dissipated by now anyways. So that would be for 9 slashing damage. 9 slashing. Just give me a second. Yes. It's up to me. So I mean like the minute is still going. If you want to, you haven't, you only were hit oh. once, but like I, I, like it wasn't enough to like be much. So I, I'd like, so right. it's still, it's still up for a few turns. Since it's a concentration thing, and I've taken an attack action, would it have? No, no, that's fine. You can, you can, you can, you can, you can still, you can still concentrate and attack. Oh, it's wow. only if okay. you get hit or cast another concentration spell. Interesting. Okay. But yeah, you uh, you do notice, like you feel like your uh, ear, um, your your ear hardware has shut down. You feel like someone's oh, almost wow. like blocking it. Yeah. All I could hear, honestly, was the flow of like my inner workings, um, mm. and kind of like my, yeah, there, there, there was that that I was hearing, which was kind of relaxing in a very eerie way, um, mm -hmm. and eerie. so the the last thing I wanted to do was uh, I haven't done that in a while. It's the shield bash uh, thing. I'm yeah. just trying to click on it. No worries. While you're um, trying to click on that. Randall, roll me a D100 and then a D20. Oh, one day. Oh, crap. 
Uh, on the D20, it's a 13. Mm -hmm. And on the D100, it's a 16. Perfect. Okay. I'll get. You will find out what that does soon. I don't like how you said that. <clears throat> and so it will be. Um, uh, uh, sorry. Uh, shield. Uh, no, sorry. It's okay. It's strength check? Yes. A strength check. So you try, you're just trying to shield bash it? I shot yeah. it like five feet. Yeah, basically. Yeah. Or making it prone actually would be cooler. Since right. it's already entangled, like making it prone is. Uh, I believe that it's against my own strength, right? Yeah, if you want to roll strength for me. Yes. Okay. You aren't able to knock it prone. It just. It like it's still pushing into you with its body. Hmm. And All it's, right. It, it yes, almost muscles you back. Wow. Okay. Uh, with my spare hand, though, I would like to do an extra attack uh, that I forgot that I could do. <laughs> um, mm -hmm. And I, I'll try to hit it. Um, that hits. All right. And uh, this time I'm aiming at its head for another nine slashing. Mm -hmm. And as like you feel it pushing into you, and you've just like bashed it with your shield. You pull away. As it like, you see its head incline inwards at you, as it's like pushing in at your shield, and you just see this perfect, just, um, slashing point, and as like Rocky still um, catch uh, slashing at it, and it's keeping its arms out of the way essentially, you were able to get just this, the cleanest slash on the yokai before it can even make a jitter, a jape, a chitter or shriek at you. You just see its mouth fall off as you cut away at its neck and it just erupts into white fire and it's gone. That great Shabbaton has been defeated. And uh, quick question, far away. did it drop its war hammer? Or did it burn with the yokai? Roll for me slight hand. If you want to try and catch the Warhammer. Yes. You see its Warhammer just begin to start disintegrating, but you catch it. Um, would you have to let go of your shield or your sword uh, to free one of your hands to catch it? Yeah. Any, uh, any, any specific ones you want to drop? I can drop. I mean, they're both part of the same thing, yeah. um, ultimately, but... Is it like a I magnet? Does it pull at the other thing to like pull it t uh, together again? How's that? Uh, when, when they're not... Uh, when, they're not I, when I'm not holding? Yeah. I guess, like, how I understand it is that when, like, since it's a free action, right, to kind of, like, whisk it back into its umbrella form, mm -hmm. um, I have always connected them together, but this time, if I drop it, I don't see... If it changes anything, uh, anyways, it, I don't know. It just kind of like when it drops, it just falls back into on on itself into a um, flower that hasn't uh, bloomed yet. And you, okay. as the hammer is disintegrating in the air, you catch it, and the weight almost pulls you down. But you see the disintegration reforms, and you just hold this very crude iron uh, war hammer that is just. Oh. You you have to put like all your strength in to hold it, but you are holding it now. And what I'm gonna say awesome. is, we're gonna. Satoshi's gonna just then shout as soon as that Shaban's gone. Uh, then shout. We should probably run. We should probably just keep going. And the wind will hold him off surely. Um, but we should run. Where is he saying this yes. from? I can't even see Satoshi right now. He's over oh, here. He's yeah, he's just around the okay. trees. Um. But as, as, as they give that um, suggestion to start running, we're going to take a quick break. We're going <laughs> to... We're going to get 10, right. 15 minutes. Um, and then we'll uh, see the aftermath of this little encounter. See you guys in a hot second. All right. See you.
Hello! Hi! Hello Raiders, we're just on our break, we're just about to come back, we're waiting for one of our players just uh, to finish getting some water I think, I don't know. Uh, and we are going to throw a quick pre-roll uh, just so the next people joining in the heart, next half hour don't get any ads themselves. But hi! Hello everyone, how you guys doing? How was your stream? We've just, my players have just been, uh, they've done a little funeral rite for a bunch of golden um, uh, people that like had... Um, there's there's a lot of baggage on that one. There's basically a bunch of gold people. They had to, their their souls have left their, them in like just golden husks now. They've uh they've done a little they've probably done a little funeral right now. They're fighting a bunch of yokai and there's also some robots that like uh, two of the players recognize because they were inmates at this prison where the gold people are also from. As I said, there's a lot of baggage. You just finished your first session of spell time. How was that? I, I recently was playing the Spelljammer campaign with Phoenix Waki uh, a few weeks ago. I say a few weeks ago, this is months. But like, yeah, no, that's that's really cool. Spelljammer is hella neat. Are you doing stuff from Radiant Citadel or just... Uh, is it all homebrew or is it just stuff from the book and stuff? I I know nothing about Spelljammer. The, cran, the grand tradition of raiding into a break. It'd be like that sometimes. But I think, thank you guys for being here. Thank you guys for bringing your viewers here. And I hope uh, they enjoy the vibes. We will be back soon. Yes. Sam is here, so I'm gonna be go. I'm gonna be right back. We're gonna play the intro again just after the pre rolls, and we're gonna go straight into things. It's very, very fun. Our DM is super fun. I'm very glad to hear. It's stuff from the book. Oh, that's hella neat. Um, if you want to share more about it, you can hop into the Discord and join uh, and like talk about it in the TTRPG room. There'd be probably a bunch of people that would be really interested in hearing how that goes. And you can also promote your stream there too if you want to in the promo room. But yeah, I'm gonna be right back. And we're gonna pre roll. Um, intro and then all the things. See you guys in a second. Thank you. 
when you run it out of stocks of golf. When you rub against the wall and you cannot fall, so go off, 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 I mean, I want to say it actually, but there's so many <laughs> bits and pieces of everything that. There's so much mm. happening for Lo Fi Boys that I feel like it just is like unnecessary. Not yeah. here? Like, Hello, everyone, it. by the way. Hi. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna do this because uh, you guys are now. Um... Yeah, Satoshi just told you. Um, the robots are here. He's got the wind blocking them, but you guys should probably start running. What are you guys doing? Which way are we running, guys? I love running. I up this way. my weapon. This way, there's the bridge. The Little secondary bridge. Go around the same tree. tree. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So yeah, basically, how this is gonna work is you're gonna like each like move. Yep. That's how running works. Yeah. Everyone roll for me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Don't don't get slick with me. Okay. Everyone roll for me <laughs> a dext. Because of the entangled uh, roots in the way, you'll need to roll. To run through that, you'll have to roll a dex. Uh, a if I athletic... stop concentrating, it just goes away, you know? Okay, don't. Oh, fine. But if I see <laughs> everyone <laughs> trying to, like. I mean, I was just going to misty step over it, but. <laughs> I mean. I mean, would you like to misty step immediately? You can. Randall, are, are, are you pointing at the entangle or something? I just, what are you doing? What's your body language? Uh, panicked and, <laughs> <laughs> and wanting to I move. Mean, wait, wait, that was one, two, three, okay? I, I would have stopped uh, the concentration on the entangle because. Okay. Yeah. Alright, yeah, all right, the entangle, yeah, has dropped. Like, you just see all the roots just kind of fall into the ground and turn into ash as they just, like, turn into um, the grass again and, like, just, like, just seep into the soil. You guys can start moving, though. You guys, um,. Let me start the timer again before you guys continue. So yeah, if you guys move for me, th 60 feet for me, just to see how, how that travel goes for you. 5, 10, 15, 20, 20. Because yeah, you guys can dash. That's like a I have to unzoom to, un to, to see. I get, a, I get up to here. Uh, I get up to uh, uh, 60 here. feet. I get up to oh, here okay. over by Randall. Mm -hmm. You are moving now. Um, yeah, you guys can stop moving. Yeah. Yep. So, Brandle, <laughs> slowpoke. As Just you guys be last in line, because mm -hmm. I, I, yeah. As you Reasons. guys are rushing, you guys will hear the, these crows just watching you, and they just start cawing at you as you guys start making your way uh, towards right. the bridge. So, Toshi just starts rushing as well. Shut up, crows. Thirty. The game out there. Oh, he just wanted to flex on us like that. You, he's jumped onto your shoulders, by the way, low as well as you run, mm -hmm. and you can hear the ACU just pushing through. And eventually, like you can just see. Could you, Polly, low? You guys will see this, and Satoshi will. Uh, Satoshi just starts screaming as they just begin to start running. You can see them making their way. You can see that they're like their clothing. They've got like these wraps around their bodies um, that like are like very traditional looking in design, but very sleek and very modern in uh, in execution. Uh, but it's just their clo uh, what like, the clothing that is uh, there and their hood have just been torn to shreds by both the wind soaking wet as well. And just have like just like these huge gashes and cuts and burns all over them. As you can see, their bodies are like almost falling apart in a lot of places, and they're like just 
staggering as they're rushing towards you and just like pulling their Naginatas through the ground as they're just slashing. And like you see the blue light on their bodies flicker every now and then as they as they're uh, chasing. And you can see in the husks of their helmet, you can see these blue jittering target eyes scanning and searching and chasing after you. As you can hear them just make this groaning noise as they come chasing after you. A lot weaker than the giant one um, that you guys could see above the treetops, but it's it is um, I... very distinct. Yes, Loniko. Can I use Yuki to cast Entangle? You can. Um... My time to shine. <laughs> what do you want me to do, Loniko? I got this. Ah. Hang on, I need to zoom out. I... Uh, <laughs> uh, it, you can cast it from 90... hang on... 90 feet. Not worry, then they'll they will stay on your shoulders, they will not <laughs> uh, budge. Um, so, where where they are, basically, um, I can't quite see. Um, Alright, just give me a second, I'm just going to move Yuki's uh, headshot. It's about here. I'm going to move Yuki so oh, I can wait. see where they are. Nice. You want to move Yuki over here? I just want to see where they are. Um, it's twenty foot by twenty foot, isn't it? Yep. So, I would like to cast it um, around just behind Satoshi. Mhm. Mm Alright. Cool. Oh, I shouldn't do that. Yeah. Yuki just um. You see Yuki just like wave their tails outwards as you see behind Satoshi fire uh, push out of the ground and turn into just a bushel or a yeah a bushel of or well, not even a bushel I don't think a, a bush of spider lilies that was the word I was looking for a bushel small isn't it a just a huge 20 foot uh, bush of spider lilies that like their petals look like fire curling in and like flexing almost wanting to grab onto something as they just turn and tangle and weave themselves around each other as Satoshi is still running. Yeah, you guys can move another set of 60 feet uh, before uh, they continue chasing after you. If you guys want to keep moving. I, okay, I will wait. How, how many? 5, 10, 15, 20. I'll only move 40 feet because I'll go, I'll move with Satoshi. Mm -hmm. Okay. Give me a second. Yeah, so Toshi's coming up behind you guys. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. And then they'd get just there. Okay, so I'd probably be around here then. As the ACU Let's still... go, Satoshi. Oh boy! We'll get to that. <laughs> Hello! Friend or foe? Like this forest. Before you continue, I'm just gonna just roll two uh, set of strength saves. Let's what was see. your DC, uh, low? 16. You just hear you like, yes! I got two of them. <laughs> There was only two, yeah, wasn't there? You can, <laughs> as they just get, yeah, they get entangled. You can just says there was, there was just, there was two of them, right? Just, just two, right? Uh, yeah, sure. I don't yeah. actually know. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah, no, yeah. I, I got, I got, I got them all. There, we got them, guys. No, no worries anymore. They're all done. And we're gonna move over to the bridge, and I'm gonna change the playlist as we do this. Yeah, so you see just cross, not cross leg, but like knee, not kneeling, but like kind of in a meditative state on the at the end of the bridge, this silhouette of a person with a very big head. As you get a closer look at them, you notice that's not a head. That's a watermelon. As uh, this is the watermelon. <laughs> Yes, you recognize this is the watermelon yokai. Uh, watermelon head. <laughs> I wanna cut off my feet. 
You did this. <laughs> I know I did it to myself. You see, well, I mean, is it, you you know it immediately as soon as you see it open all its eyes. The what like pinkish red eyes, a uh, target eyes darting, scanning all of you as you see its rind covered in these uh, eyes and a jagged maw from the side of its head open. And it just starts making glitching noises as it starts to, uh, as it goes to stand up and then just starts speaking to you as a cold wind blows by and they pick up their katana that was on the ground in front of them. But Lone Nico. My katana's ready. Your katana's ready? Yeah. Perfect. Lone Nico, I you, see him take his out. So. Yeah, you, you don't hear a word. You don't understand a word they're saying. It's just to you, it sounds like. Give me a second. It sounds like this. And it sounds like a bunch of this. And then. One of these. As it looks at you specifically, Randall. I mean, you're not Randall, sorry, Rocky. Lone Nico and Randall. For oh, some reason, wow, you, wow. you your ears perk as soon as you hear this voice come from this watermelon creature. You! Samurai! Samurai! Stone man with swords! Swords! Do you seek to cross my bridge? Bridge! Uh, I it would just, like to. You yes. don't understand it, Rocky. You have no clue oh, what uh, I'm saying. Only Lone say Nico and Randall say it, though. Uh, oh, my bad. It. Um, no, it's okay. You just hear it jitter at you as it points his sword out at you. I point my sword back at it because I, I I know that in the samurai world that it means it wants to fight. <laughs> <laughs> Rocky, I think he wants to fight you so we can cross the bridge. Hey, hey, I I have been looking for a snack, so <laughs> nothing better than watermelon on a hot summer's day. I don't know it. I don't know how hot it is right now, but uh, regardless, I'm gonna kill it. Just strike true, Rocky. You got this. When you say um, that, defeat me? No. Our blades are sharp, yes. Yes. I don't know what you're saying. But I don't know. I can't. I don't know what you're. Do I don't know what. Did anybody speak watermelon? I do. <laughs> as you. You do? <laughs> as you say that, you hear it. You see it go to cough. Bless you. Hmm. My modern Sheen isn't good. Yes, yes. You, Ruckman, fight me. Fight, it says, pointing at you again. Did I hear it? When yeah, it you said could, that, it's or? English. It speaks in uh, not English, modern Shein now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, I don't understand what English. Oh, I'm, <laughs> that. Uh, I'm sorry, Alakis uh, no. is the word I was looking for. Yes. All right. Well, I'll go easy on you because I, I don't really no. care to kill you. It seems like you have like a thing going on, and like yes. I respect it, but I do want to cross, so I will just kind of hurt you bad and like. Up to the point where you surrender, if that sounds good with you. That is more than fine. Okay, so you but agree. Okay, do you know that I'm gonna you're gonna surrender? Sick. I have I have a term. One term. Single single term. Alright. Yes. Okay. Those weapons you possess, possess. I want them. Thomas. If I if you lose, they are mine. Yes. Yes. If I lose, meaning I yield and or die. Yes. These are yours. Yes. And if I win, I cross the bridge. Uh all right. Uh, could I could I have one of your katanas? Yes. If I win? Yes, you can. Yes. Do you Cal have one or wait. two? I can't tell. I have one. Okay. I want your katana if I win too. Along what? with me and all of my buddies crossing the bridge. Yes. What's that? What's okay. it? What's what's that one? The one that is like of, of swords but not folded. What's that one doing? What are as, you it about? To, as it points to low fi boy. I don't really. Hey, 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 hey! I, I, I put my sword Wait, like kind of blocking, blocking Lo-Fi. I just kind of gesture and wave my hands a little bit and tell him to kind of get behind me, like with my thumb, like. And then I just I gesture with my hand, being like, "Hey." <laughs> Sorry. Can I? I'm, what's going on exactly, guys? Why are you all deaf. so quiet? Can I go up and just take Lo-Fi boys? Oh my God, he's deaf. <laughs> <laughs> so sorry, uh, Mr. Uh, what, what should I call you? I, I feel like watermelon's rude. I am the Suika Abake. You may call Suica me Suika or Abake. Either or. Suika? Okay, that's pretty. Suica. A Suika. <laughs> uh, Do not make jokes, Ruckman. This is. I'll make jokes if I want to. All right, fine. I, one more turn if I win. I want to make a joke. And you, I want you to laugh. Fine. Okay, fine, okay I will, cool. I will, I will make one haha. -ha, a singular 
Yes. Sounds as, good for me. All right. <laughs> as you say that, Low, you can cast your body inspiration if you'd like as well. I have so much. I'm sick. I'm happy. <laughs> oh, yo! That's actually genius, Low. <laughs> How are you casting your body inspiration, by the way, Low? Um, can I just like tilt my head to the side and like have my bells kind of jingle <laughs> so it's mm -hmm. a little bit more so <laughs> yeah, like it's as the wind stir like it it feels very still like the water doesn't even look like it's rushing anymore as like this is happening and but Rocky you feel a warmth as you get encouragement from Loniko and as it's happening you also uh, feel the Taya's arrows jingle in your pockets for a second as you uh, mm? uh sorry it was, it, rocky just was more of like huh oh no nice. and you feel <laughs> you get a bit of chat inspiration oh, as sick. Taya or sammy has gifted you a uh, a chat inspiration all right so i have two inspirations Speaking i have the, the bardic and i also have the uh what's the feather one called again i forget that is a uh, randall's um that, yeah, that's my like uh, I, my help action. When yeah. I said strike true, that was me yeah. giving you that also. I didn't know if there was a specific name for it. Is what else? Uh, it, 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 I mean, what does that one do again? What does it give me again? It just gives you advantage. Gives me one advantage. Um, yeah, on your next attack. On my next attack. Okay. Also, so, hope you guys are having fun. Sorry, master continue. of tactics. That's what it's called. Okay, my master of tactics, and then my bardic gives me a d six or something, yes. right? To attack roll or damage. Attack. Uh, okay. attack roll, yeah. I can use it at any point I need to, right? Not necessarily yeah. my next one. Yeah, okay. it lasts like a minute. Okay, well. Sick. Okay. So this encounter is going to be a bit weird. It is just going to be... Unless you guys can. If you guys want to partake, you guys can. But in like... In essentially like this initial round, Rocky and uh, the Sweet Obake are going to fight. And Rocky. it's... Hmm. Sorry. Water. No, no, you go ahead. You're finished. If it's so, to see who goes first, we're gonna we're gonna use initiative. Is that how we're gonna okay. see who goes first? If you could draw initiative for oh. me, I don't even remember. No, how I don't even know if I remember how to do that. <laughs> All right, seventeen. It goes first. All right, uh, uh, Rocky in anticipation is kind of like popping his neck, swinging his arms, like sharpening his blades with the other blade. You know, just like waiting. That's it. Randall's like hyping him up like you got this. I believe in you, Rocky. I Rocky. turn to Randall and give him a wink and a smooch. As you that happens, <laughs> could you, when when you give him the wink and the smooch, could you roll for me a wisdom save, please? Me? Oh frick. Yes. Oh shoot. I I was, like, was gonna change you my face use, to like um, I don't have like a cocky face. It's kinda upsetting. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, smug, smug, smug. inspiration smug. on saving throws as well if you want. On saving throws? Okay, I might need to use it on this because my wisdom ain't Swell. Wisdom saving throw, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. That is a six <laughs> minus one. <laughs> it's a five. Uh, uh, my perfect inspiration, I feel like it's not going to help me much. It's a D6, right? So the most I'll get is 11. I'm not going to use it on this. I'm just going to take the suffering. No worries. You, in the next round, you have disadvantage on all attack rolls. But I, okay, but I can use my theoretic. I have one. Oh, no, one, mind. I don't end up being regular attack because of my. Yeah. I have one and, and my, because of Randall's feather. Yeah. Good lord. So all right, so that, that is fine. You don't have disadvantage as long as you're fighting the, uh, specifically just a sweeper Abake. If anything else fight you, you're fucked. Um, and if you attempt Wait, to move wide. a space thirty feet away from it, um, okay. oh no, that does nothing. Never mind. All right, yeah, nah. Okay. It just compels so you to so a duel. I only no have reason. I only have disadvantage against you, other things. I other, can fight yeah. this thing perfectly fine. Yeah. Okay, so and this it, essentially does nothing to me at the moment. Okay. Yeah, it does nothing. But in a flash, you just you guys see the waters like below as um, air just like pushes towards you guys as a sweet barke like lightning is on Rocky. And with two just quick slashes of its katana, it's gonna do two slashes on you. Alright. Yeah, that's but... <laughs> That's one hit, one miss. One, no worries. Dealing eight damage on you. And your speed has been reduced by 10 feet. That's fine. I mean, I'm not going and anywhere right now. then it's going to headbutt you with its giant water. <coughs> head. 
What the heck, dude? <laughs> oh, complete mission. I it dodge out of way, move into the side briefly. All it, smug like. It gets stunned. You are fast. Yes, yes. It is your Thank turn, you. now, Rocky? I give it a wink and a smooch. Uh, you see it blush. <laughs> I can't tell if it's just the watermelon inside of it or not. <laughs> um, wait, so I lost uh, eight eight damage eight, or eight, eight HP. One second, I yeah, got it. Uh, uh, I got it. Uh, okay, nice. And your speed has been reduced okay. by uh, ten. Oh, Sam, don't say that shit. Sam, you upset me. Okay, not you, oh, Sam. You said no, squirt some melon Sorry. juice. Okay. No, because it, it rolled a nat one. Wrong. Come on, people. It rolled a nat one with its head, but. Uh, All right. Uh, some so moist like, melon oh, juice. Maybe, maybe like you know, some juice leaks out of the melon. No, yeah, stop. stop. I don't know. <laughs> so easy. Oh, I'm with you, Sam. I'm with you. Thank okay. you. Thank you. Because like, are we saying that squirt and leak are bad words? No, yes. Come on. I think those those two specifically. Come on. <laughs> it's not fair. Can we do a poll? Can, can we do yeah, a poll? Fine. All right. Give me a second. Okay. Um, okay, so I, I want to, so for my first one, I have advantage of from uh, the feather, um, automatically. So this is my first attack, um, with advantage, that's a 14 hit, question mark. Wow. If not, I'll use my bardic inspiration. It does not hit, but you will have Okay, to I'm going to do the 1d6. I forget how to, as it just exclamation point one, or... Or uh, you should. I mean, you can go at the top left and roll the d6 from the dice. Oh, uh, oh, that's option. right. Uh, or you could just type. I think. Slash uh, roll d6. sixteen hit. Does a sixteen, 16 hit? It? Misses. It catches oh. you, even though it gets stunned in that, uh, from your kiss and your it, uh, attempted headbutt. It catches you um, mm -hmm. with okay. its katana, and oh. it just kind of like realigned itself with you mm -hmm. um create itself pa making itself parallel with you um that's it can it make a con saving throw for me please guys it can <laughs> okay uh should i do the rest of my actions yet or wait till that con save wait till the con save it, it takes two thunder damage <laughs> it gets stunned oh your magic is strong just like your sword i think man appreciate it uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do my, my my bonus attack. For my inspiration, do I have to wait to do I have to do it automatic, automatically, or do I or can I wait to see if I miss first before you think I forget? What was it? Sorry. For my inspiration, can I roll attack and then use it if I miss, or do I have to say I want to do it before I? I will roll let attack? you use it after. Like you get to okay. you, you decide. Okay, this is my my two weapon fighting bonus action thing for my. I oh. freaking. <laughs> Why did, oh, I didn't mean to have an uh, advantage on that, but I yeah, think the first like, four was a 14. Um, yeah. Okay. Well, then... Okay, I didn't mean to use the advantage, but if, if well, you want to do, take do you want, away do you want one to count those, it? You don't I mean, to... I, now I do want to use my inspiration, but uh, uh, so I'll just take that nine. It's fine. Um, oh. So I, 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 I miss with that. Yeah, I'll let you, my... you re-roll that like, one. Like, that was... And, yeah. You can re-roll that, like, uh, that attack. With advantage. Oh, okay. Thanks. Uh, either way, uh, this is <laughs> my rolls are bad. Oh goodness. Okay. Uh, my oh, next goodness. attack, my, my bonus, or not my bonus attack, but my my. You pulled in, by the way. Sorry, going yeah. Your second attack. My second attack. Come on, I need a hit. Oh, I, oh, it was about to be a nat one. I was with these I know that nineteen hits. It better hit. If not, I'm, I'm quitting. It. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> be dramatic about it. Now I'm quitting. <laughs> That's nine damage. Your blade, yes, very sharp. As you cut uh, like a chunk out of its head. I'm gonna go ahead and use my my um, action surge and attack again. Go ahead. Um, Slice up that melon, Rocky. Another 19 to hit, or that 27 hits. to hit. 27 hits. Uh, eight damage. Mm-hmm. And I guess that's the end of my turn. Yes, I'm very sharp. Now, Thanks. you, the rest of you guys have a chance to do something if you want to do something. I mean, like, I, I'll just give him another advantage of like, yeah, like, you got him, Rocky, keep going. 
I got, am all out of bardic feather. inspiration. But I get a feather. That's all that matters. Um, is Yuki still one with of Randall's me? dragon feathers? Yeah, Yuki will still be with you. <laughs> I'll, I'll let him stay with um, you for another t- one until like you get your game only for one use, but he'll stick with you till. Um, can I know Yuki's visible right now, but can yeah. he be not visible? <laughs> yeah, you can. You can. You can go ethereal. <laughs> can I ask him to go invisible so he can go up to Rocky um, and touch him? And cast this. <laughs> of course. And you see, you see Yuki just got to make a hushed whisper noise and then just shimmy out of existence. Rocky, roll me perception. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Something I'm great at. All right, Nate. Yeah, no worries. <laughs> As. Answer my legs. Uh, touch, touch Rocky. Sorry. Yeah, it, t- yeah, it touches Rocky. Yeah. I'm sorry, they touch Rocky. Those villains, one willing creature. Touch. touch. You feel a little paw print on your ankle. And Stay you... away from me, devil melon. <laughs> I don't know what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> you, see, you feel that skirt just billow as you said. I am away from you, but that fox isn't. That was against what? our bargain. As you see, eyes look down at it. How does it you see? You don't it? see. You, you just see its, its, its eyes just see. As his how, eyes does, look, how does the melon see it? Did it roll perception or did it, it just need know? To. Or? It just knows. Oh no. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. As you feel this on your this <laughs> footprint on you, it's touching you right now. As you get protection <clears throat> of good and evil, the, it creatures disadvantage on attack rolls against you. All right. Let's give you a little... I don't think I have a token for this one. So we're going to give uh, a little shield. Yeah, like... Yuki, <laughs> gaslight the man. Okay, you don't see me. No, happening. I'm a figment of your imagination. <laughs> Do not lie to me. I don't fucks. know what you're talking about, Melon. Melon, you're being a melon head right now. Chill Stop out. you! you. <laughs> I'm having a conversation with a fox. I know I'm a fox. I know I look good, but <laughs> that house, uh, you're making me blush too, man. <laughs> You see the melon blush and just start shift colors just a bit. Like, no, <laughs> silence, <could. laughs> silence. Uh, this is a matter of spirits. Fox, you cheat the game. Step back and I will not do harm. Uh, <laughs> you can come back. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I just kind of turned him. I don't know. If, I don't know if you guys just saw what I just did there, but I actually made Yuki like do like this weird flip with his token. <laughs> oh. <laughs> See if I can catch it on the stream real quick. Oh my goodness! Um, <laughs> you cheat, rock man. <laughs> I don't. Hey, no. I I turned to my friends. I was like, guys, I got this. I gave them all a wink, and then I turned to Randall specifically and gave him another smooch. And then <laughs> anything I, else uh, you'd like to do. <laughs> Oh, that's the end of my turn, yeah. Oh, no, no, sorry. Okay. Anything else anyone else wanted to do? Oh, yeah. Um, did I, wait, did I get a feather from uh, Randall? He, he I, used it on me, right? I he did, used yeah, on I his initial one, but he, you can give it yeah, to I, him I'll, if I'll do it again, absolutely. Mm-hmm. Like, Anything else? Can... It shouldn't take much longer, Rocky, you got this. And then we'll have lunch. What are you doing, Lo-Fi Boy? Can't wait. <laughs> I'm just going back to the end of the line. Or, or actually, could I could I ask uh, Lil Nico like, what's up with through message now? Like, are we are the ACs behind us? Oh shit! Oh, I actually, see it now. I don't even have to ask her. Oh, so yeah. As you go to like walk off the bridge, you do see them just rush in behind you. Oh, ah. <laughs> you should see them just like make a noise. Oh boy! Yeah, we... Someone watch the deaf guy. Quick, we may have, him. we may have a situation on that. What's going on? As you said, you see the uh, the Suiko Bakke's eyes go over your shoulders for a second because it's it's around your height as well. You yes, bring those mechanical tired. abominations with you, abominations. No, no. Do not turn your back from me. I was looking at what you're looking. I, tur- I had to see what's going on. Use Still. your back eyes. I don't back got eyes. those. Well, do you? I do. 
Okay. Well, well, how would you feel if I told you to use your rock skin? You don't have rock skin now, do you? Well, All you right? should use your rock skin. It would I be a good guard my against skin. my sword. Right. And well, anyways. Well, <laughs> so, like, now that that's happened, we're going to go back into normal initiative. I'm going to say... Randall and Lo, because you guys did something. You, uh, Lo-Fi Boy, Satoshi, and Polly, you guys have an action before we go back into the... Uh, Back into standard initiative. Okay. You have what? An back into action? back. Yeah, you got like one initial action. You've already done yours, and Lonika have already done theirs. Okay. So Polly and so Ra Rocky, what would you like to do first? I mean, not Rocky. Sorry, Lofi, what would you like to do first? I'd like to enter rage again. All right, you've entered rage, my lad. Describe it before we go into. Um. Oh 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 oh! Can I this time uh, try to feed uh, my weapon? Oh yeah, you go ahead. Uh, yeah? Okay. Roll on So, okay, let me do that. So this time, um, like, usually what I do for the weapon when I try to sh shift its form, I try to assume a position, try to get its feel to see, like, what kind of, like, form it will take. But this time, having caught the um, Warhammer from the <laughs> defeated uh, Greater Shabbaton, I, I'm trying to like see if I can like fuse them together or feed my weapon mm. uh, the Warhammer. You feel when you're trying to feed them, you feel there's a mm. magnetism between both pulling at each other, and you do see the hammer just like kind of turning into your magic, uh, like glitching into like squares and just shifting uh, sur magic uh, surge uh, surge fields. Also, I forgot the wild magic surge. Could chat roll me a d20, please. Um, <laughs> very sorry about that um, but yeah you feel your magic getting pulled in and it doesn't fully melt in but like it is now just like a small portion of the handle but you do feel your sword getting heavier okay um, so what form is it in right now just sword st standard sword yeah okay um, and the warhammer is gone the warhammer is gone Cool. And so I enter rage. Do -do -do -do. Um. <laughs> oh. Okay. Um. Oh, sorry. I meant D six. Sorry, Iskra. Oh. So it's uh, this one, Gaz. Um. What does the fox say? Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So. <laughs> um, I summon a kitsune at a location within 30 feet. As, yeah, as, what also happens? As you're surging, Lo, you see Yuki rushing to you in the invisible state and then suddenly get just pulled out of nothing. <laughs> Whoop! Hey! Oh. 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 Oh, I, oh my goodness. I'm trying to work here. I I'm trying to be helpful, and then you go and do your stupid, stupid thing, you stupid robot man. I just see it like opening and closing its mouth. Like, I can't <laughs> <hear>. <laughs> Don't pretend like you can't so hear me. I'll get inside you, I will. I don't want to be that person, but Yuki knows my spells, right? Yes. And I know message. You do. <laughs> As you, as you say, as like you are, like, do you say that to like, uh, Yuki, or do you say anything to Yuki? Uh, uh, lo -fi boy? Me? Yeah. What do you mean if I say anything? Uh, I'm like, uh, I, I can't hear you, uh, you know? Um, and I try to... How about now, you stupid robot boy, as oh, oh. it casts a message in your head. <laughs> stupid um, idiot, like... Not, to work. I was. Can't you see an I artist? <laughs> I'm just saying. Uh, no, don't, like, don't say. Don't, I, don't get those angry I eyes out of here. I never needed to hear you, anyways. You can stop the, nope. the message thing. No, I refuse. Uh, I know because I can't you, hear you. You, you can't tell I, me to I stop. I can't hear you. Only Lo, you can't right hear me. Even now? then, no, don't stop pretending. I'm messaging you. I, I think, know you can hear I me. I know. That's it. That's Even it. Even in my mind right now, as, it must be pretty serious. <laughs> as Yuki starts, you see Yuki's climbing into his little like crevice of uh in your knee, and shrinking, 
and now you have Yuki inside you. <laughs> what are you doing inside? You get out of there! No, you get out of here, stupid. Anything uh, you'd like to do on your turn? <laughs> yeah, I guess with Yuki inside of me. Uh... <laughs> hey, stop moving! <laughs> not as... Well, yeah, I told you to get out. Um, I, I will run uh, right uh, towards the. The closest ACU. No, and other way, idiot. Stupid. With the sword. Um, mm -hmm. I'm gonna click here. Slash. Oh, you are such an inconvenience. 25 hits. <laughs> oh, wow. 15. Goodness. Yeah, like they're falling apart, though, to be fair. And so, yeah, you are able to just, like, just batter and slash away and cut uh, most of the ACU unit. And it is just struggling to hunker down and try to block you with its uh, naginata um but you are just like, cleaving away at it with your very calculated methodical slashes yeah As and with then the uh, yeah? yeah no no go on, go on. i mean it's still standing right it is still standing yeah so i would extra attack do that again mm -hmm. rocky could you roll me a d100 as well please yeah 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 11 misses. This time it does catch your Naginata. You almost feel like Yuki's biting at your root and pulling at your uh, at them, causing you, to, like, causing you to like just pull back just a bit. What? What? Huh? Now you can hear me, huh? Interesting. Now, now, now you want to talk to me? Oh, I, I get it. When, when I'm being an inconvenience to you, you think? Yuki. Oh. I don't know if you're saying anything right now, but that's um, I, I, that, that when you bit me, I actually felt la, that, la, that la, was Nope, can't hear him, can't hear stupid robot man, stupid tin boy, stupid... Uh, he's the one casting message, I can't believe. Yeah, he is casting message at you. <laughs> 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 Anything uh, Anyways, yeah, uh, bonus action, I You can't like use your bonus action. I cannot, oh Not no, yet. I've already reached, thank you. Satoshi uh, is... Yeah, no, I'm, that's it. Uh, oh yeah, I would like to... Go on, sorry. Yeah? No, no, go on. Uh, is it popcorn right now, or is it initiative? It's, it's popcorn. Initiative. It's not. It's not. Uh, it'll still be popcorn, but like where like you just it's only actions until into the actual thing, because this is just can like so... as like they were fighting. Mm -hmm. Um. Can I? Can I? Oh, I can't send the, the popcorn to Yuki. That's Lil Nico, right? Yeah, Lil Nico. But Satoshi okay, is going to do it. their thing, and then uh, Polly, yeah. you cool. just get your turn ready in a second. I and understand. How does cool. this work? Oh, it's lightning lure, isn't it? That's the one that like does the thing. <laughs> So yeah, it's gonna um Satoshi's gonna come uh come beside you, uh Lo Fi Boy. And then it's just gonna quickly pick up a rock and then catapult it at the uh, <laughs> actually no it's not, it's gonna lightning law instead. At the uh at the ACU unit. Give me a second. Strand save. That's how does this work again. So yeah, as um as it's like you are just like arguing with uh, Yuki and slashing away at the uh, at this ACU, you see a um you see a Satoshi come beside you and like, pull a whip of lightning out of their hair as you see their hair begin to start storming and become um, stormy waves, and they just throw it over uh, the, this ACU in the back, pulling them forward, dealing eleven damage to them, and they do get pulled uh, towards Satoshi. Ooh, I didn't think that one through. <laughs> As they get like, right in his face. Yeah, I kind of look at Satoshi like, what? Oh, wait, no, no, I got this, I got this. I know, this. I've, I've, oh, I Jesus. learned Kung Fu for this. As you just hear it, just just make its mechanical groan, right? Oh, you don't see this happen, but everyone else sees Satoshi just get this groaned uh, shriek in its face from the AC unit. Polly, what would you like to do before we go back into the, all the things? Uh, do, do you think I'd be able to convince Mel and Man to, to help us with these guys? You can try, yes, you can. I, I, I would like to try that. What are you going to say to them? Um, hi, 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 buddy, you remember yes. me? Yes, Corrin girl, yes. Yeah, we, we crossed paths earlier. Yes, we're, you crossed my bridge, yes, yes, yes. My bridge. You, yeah, you let me cross because we're great friends. I, I don't recall uh, calling you my friend. Friend? Well, I would like to call you friend. You know, I felt we What's really had... What's your name? Had... So, like, so we can confirm we're friends. 
My name is Polly. Um, Hello, Polly. I don't think Polly. we were ever formally introduced. What's your name? My name's Suiko Abake. Suiko Abake. It Suiko. is a absolute pleasure uh, to make your acquaintance. How are you doing? The pleasure's um, all mine, as they're like blocking one of Iraqi's <laughs> slashes, holding it right at their face. How's uh, how's uh, you know, uh, I would love to talk more, but th we've got these guys over here and they're really yes, abominations. Us. Yes, I, I don't know. Um, maybe you know, we could have a better chat if we got these guys out of the way. I don't suppose you'd want to help us, um, um, get rid of these guys so that we could, you know, uh, get to our, our, our friendly little chat quicker. Yes, glad, gladly, gladly. They are d disrespectful display of our So crime. disrespectful. It just says as oh. it jitters. Okay, that's 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 really awesome. Thank you so much. But for first, help. I must really... take care of Rockman here. No, oh. no, hey, we can we can come um, back to this. Ro, no, we can mean. Oh, we fight. Actually, go fight them. No, we can meet. You have a better chance. What was that, sorry, Polly? Uh, I actually need Rockman. Uh, he's um, he's protecting me and i so i need his help mm -hmm. uh actually so maybe if you guys could finish up your little duel later i know it's very important i would never ask you to you know i would never ask you to do uh you know put this thing off if if this other thing you know wasn't <laughs> so pressing um so maybe if you guys could just like delay that a little bit it'd be really cool we won't cross this bridge until it's all finished we promise. Yeah, I you promise You see, like, too. its eyes just dart at all of you as it's, like, holding its sword um, up against you, Rocky. And it gives. Okay. But if you right. cross, if you make more than, if you cross this line and you see him just draw just about, like, a, an imaginary line behind you, Rocky. Like, you don't, there's no actual line, it's just, like, just here. If you don't, if you cross here, I will kill you for crossing me and lying. Thank you so much for your help. Whoa! Put my line back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'll walk this. I'll oh, but yeah. Uh, Polly, you will be, be leading the initiative now, so like you can start. So would uh, you start the uh, start the round? What would you like to do? Uh, oh. Sorry, what was that? You are going to start the round, uh, mm -hmm. and I will also note, Rocky, you feel your entire body suddenly. Let me just see what this means. Just to confirm what it does. You feel your body become air. You suddenly start feeling yourself hazy and like almost in double speed as you just begin to start, your rock surfaces start glistening and shifting. And you just feel like you are mist and air. You have and gained what? the blur effect. And you, oh. anything that attacks you has disadvantage on attack rolls against you for the next minute. Wait, has disadvantage against me? Against you. Or, so That's when it. they attack me? Yeah. Okay. You, yeah. The wild magic has searched on you to give you blur. Oh. Okay. I don't know I have the blur. I feel a little woozy and I might need some glasses, but I feel great. <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to put that on just so that we know you got blur. But yeah, Polly, what would you like to do? So you're, you're first. My collection of items. Uh <laughs> Ooh, okay. Uh, so I think. Mm, I think. Can I wait? Do I have vicious mockery? You might check your spells. Let's see. I think I do. Uh, heat I think metal, you would. cure wounds. You yeah. heat metal. Can I... Heat metal does damage. Heat metal. Ooh, it's a good spell. Let's do that. Let's do that. Oh, yes. Let's heat <laughs> go to this metal. And you also do have vicious um, mockery as well. It, well, yeah, we'll save that for later when we need to talk mad smack. Um, mm. I'm going to, because these guys are made out of metal. They are? Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm going to try to heat the one closest to Satoshi, I think. Mm hmm And, and, and... <clears throat> Just gonna make him real spicy. Just gonna make him <laughs> real hot. Hopefully, uh, damage him. So, uh, do I just click the thing? Yep. Uh, where did it go? 
Where, where the heck it should be in your attack blind? sections as well, in your normal spell sheet. If I just check for you as well. Where'd I put it? Oh, there you are. Oh. Constitution save. They fail. <laughs> so yeah, you, um... <laughs> what does your how do you how do you would you describe what your magic looks like? The... like was it what like what is like the general like visual aesthetic of it? Wasn't like glitter and sparkles, I believe. Oh yeah, absolutely yeah. just uh Edward Cullen level sparkles. <laughs> <laughs> I love it so much. As <laughs> as you just like yeah, you start like it starts glittering and then you see all like the metal surfaces on it just start glowing red. And you can just hear you can just hear from the glass um, mask that like it has over its head that's like being that's cracking in places. You can just hear it just groan and just shriek as you see it, it just kind of contort and shift as its entire body gets heated up. That sucker. And then it turns its head to you and but keeps one of its target eyes focused on you. Never uh, mind. <laughs> Keep it. Keep it. Anything else you'd like to do, Polly? Uh, nope, I'm good to to end my turn. Who do you want to pass it to? Uh, uh, nobody else is gone yet, right? Nobody, yes, yep, no? You are the only person that's gone. Oh, heck yeah. Uh, I'm going to pass it to, uh, Lo-Fi. Ah. Uh, having seen the, the glitter thing, I, I kind of nod back at Polly, who, um, I guess, like, inspired mm -hmm. me. <laughs> <laughs> um, alright, um, I will, uh, move, um, next to, uh, Satoshi. Are you still focusing on this may. one? Uh, yeah. Okay. Can I do that? You can, yeah. As long as you focus on it, like, it won't attack opportunity on you. Yeah. And, um, uh, kick Yuki out of my leg. <laughs> <laughs> Yuki just falls out. Yeah. Hey! Hey! That's, oh my goodness. And then just comes running back and starts biting at your ankle. Ah, uh, Yuki. No. You, you will... You, I, I'm just saying, you're not exactly being very useful right now. I'm not trying to be useful. You summoned, summoned me for no reason, stupid. I didn't do Look! It's not something that I try to do on purpose, okay? It just kind of <laughs> happens. Oh. Uh. <laughs> As? That. Yeah. So you got... You get a sudden flash of pain in your ankle. As you feel you oh. can bite you. <laughs> what the hell? You take... Five damage. Is it half if uh, because you rage? Yeah, it would be. Um, you only take two damage, but that like that sudden surge of pain and just anger <laughs> from Yuki biting you, you bring your sword down with such force and power. You roll damage. Let's see. Let's see how. Let's see how well. You, how much? Oh my fucking Whoa. goodness! <laughs> yeah, no, you cleave this ACU unit in half, and they just fall to nothing and just crumble away. I'm gonna put them in the trees. Oh, fly boy. Yeah, that one's gone. You destroy it. I was aiming at that one as if that was you, Yuki, just so you know. Well, I'm aiming this one at you, because it's you, and it bites you again. <laughs> <laughs> the 17 hit. You're gonna have to bite harder than that if you wanna hurt me. You just feel his little teeth gnawing at you, and like, lo, you can see him <laughs> dangling. Cause like he's like just trying to climb up and he's like not like touching him, he's just dangling on the low lo fi boy's ankle. He's invisible to everyone else but lo fi boy and lo lonely for this moment. Uh, I'm gonna extra attack the one that's right in front of me. Mm -hmm. That hits. Alright. Goodness, lo fi boy. <laughs> you can destroy another one. Oh! Gosh, I mean, I, I, I weakened that one, obviously, and like, of course, Polly helped, so it's... Right, yeah, yeah, when you bit me and did nothing, that's what I thought. Oh, that was Satoshi saying that, sorry. <laughs> I couldn't hear it, sorry. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you just see Satoshi just, like, saying things to you, but you don't have a clue what saying. 
And you uh, hear muffled, just, ah, ah, ah you, you, you bastard, coming from Yuki as he's biting at you. But it's just muffled, even though it's message, he's just muffled as he's biting at you, because, like, he's stupid. So, <laughs> I, I try to shake off Yuki one more time, and I, I place myself, um, I guess, in front of Roll our... Roll <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> He goes flying, smashing. Hey! And, oh, that's, oh my goodness! I'm coming again, and it goes to bite you <laughs> again. <laughs> Anything else you'd like to do, my lad? Uh, I'd like to. Uh... Oh, I haven't done a bonus action this time. Uh, bonus action, I tried to push away the the ACU. Uh... Oh, are you actually? <laughs> 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 I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna try to push Yuki away. Alright, he's, he's, got a, he's got a six <laughs> on the strength. <laughs> yeah. Uh, if I can, a little bit like in, towards that direction. Yeah. God, roll strength. Oh, right, right, right. Hey! As they get, like, you just, sh you just touch him, and he goes flying, and he gets stuck in a hole in the tree. Hey! <laughs> hey! Lo, Nico, tell him! Lo! Please! Uh, and also help, I'm stuck in the tree. No, boy, please be careful. Yeah, be careful, oh. idiot. Stupid. No, no, Nico, you Don't messaged bitch. me. Um, so, actually, Yuki was biting me? Like, I just, no, no, like, he's lying. I was kissing his leg. I don't know if you have any sedatives or anything for you, that wild animal. I was casting cure saying... wounds on him. I swear. I swear to Shioka, the all four of them. I swear wow. to Shiole. What are you doing over there? I don't know. Stupid over here called me apparently and like i had to go i, I didn't want i didn't want to go i swear lo nico don't listen to him he's lying and he's stupid give my initiative to um polly actually again. polly's already done her turn you can't oh that was the oh, yeah it's, oh, it's, was sorry sorry so reset who are you passing to polly and you uh, are the only people that have had a turn oh i see it got it okay cool uh, then I I just do it I guess to uh, uh, Randall. Mm -hmm. Yeah, then Randall. Uh, I mean, like seeing as how the situation is kind of being handled pretty pretty handily by Lo-Fi Boy, I might just kind of stay here and like keep my hand on my my sword. Actually, can I like hold my action? Until watermelon guy gets like right here, probably like right yeah. around here. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to hold my action, and then when he gets there, I'm gonna like stab him in the back. I knew you. <laughs> <laughs> my man doesn't like it when people stab him in the back, but he's a okay with it. <laughs> he's a only when he does it. <laughs> he's a watermelon guarding a bridge, people. <laughs> It's a watermelon. We're this friends. Is our, mental, our mental conversation. <laughs> Are, you fr Are you friends with him? Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> Randall also oh. roll. Could you roll me a d20 and then a d100? <laughs> oh boy, howdy. <gasps> that is a 13 on the d20. And an 89 on the 100. Could you roll for me 1d6, please? Mm. I made a Godzilla noise. Six. <laughs> you feel <laughs> low and Polly, you hear, and Ra uh, Rocky, you hear, underneath Randall, the bridge just creak as you see the wood begin to start bending. As Randall, you oh. start feeling a bit heavier. And then what? just crack. You fall <laughs> through the bridge at the underneath it. <laughs> And you begin to start sinking. <laughs> what happened? You suddenly gained 60 pounds and broke the bridge. I passed my time to let it go. Flo, it's your turn. Oh, God. 
don't see. He is. I'm gonna say he's just gone ten feet in into the water. Okay. Um, can I? Uh. You just see my tattoos on my arms, like glowing blue in the water. <laughs> mm. I don't know if this is really how this works, but can I shake water around Randall as he moves down so that he could breathe? <laughs> I think you get create a fifty space. You could like push it away and give him a little air Yo, bubble. Yo, while, while I'm yeah. down here, actually, can I? Can I? What is this? Can I see what this is? Can you what? I'm, what the? Okay. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. You roll perception to see if you can see it. Okay. Yeah, can I just like fuck? Give him an air bubble. Yeah, you, you, you that yeah, yeah, moves you. with him as he sinks. Yeah, of course, yeah. You can you can just about see him through the crack in the ground that he's created. Your friend has ruined my bridge. You will pay for that. <laughs> <laughs> the Suica says to you, Rocky. <laughs> And Randall, you recognize it as like a piece of uh, a mecha that's like, um, like you can you can't see its current state. You can assume it's been like warped and damaged by the um, the explosion, and you can see crates here and they are sunk with it. And the music doesn't want to play. That's what I goddamn thought. I knew it. I that, that's me underwater. Like <laughs> no, I'm making you an air bubble. <laughs> yeah, you're not, you know you can breathe. Is it like a bubble like to the? Like it's just a bubble here. It's... Like I'm in my own. I'm in my own thoughts right now. Still, right? Yeah. Just, um... it's, it's... it's like five feet, I believe, and it's like you've got like it's around like your yeah. like, okay. head okay. and like a five feet. Cute. It, it covers most of you. All right. Sadly, the music has decided it doesn't want to work. What? So, what? you guys won't sadly be able to hear it. Uh, Don't worry, if you... I'll, I'll do it. <laughs> if you guys want the combat music, here it is. But I'm going I'm to play it for the stream on my end. Um, but yeah. Um, anything else you, uh, you want to do, Lonika? Yuki is still up for one turn before he disappears. Oh, can I still use Yuki? Yeah, I will allow you to use him for one last okay. time before he um, must disappear. Okay. Uh, I'll get him roll. to cast. Sorry. Oh. No, no. Go on. Uh... He can cast Firebolt at the last um, mm -hmm. fella. <laughs> uh, hang on, I've got a thing. Uh, I add to that now. I add my. Oh no, it's to damage down. Never mind. Firebolt. Um, yeah, no, I misses. Yuki just like stuck in the tree, struggles to push fire out of his mouth. I just like kind of like it just like just goes towards Lo-Fi Boy instead, but completely misses him as well. Um, uh, uh, what's Satoshi's health? Satoshi's health? Good point. It's 43 at the moment. Out of 51. Uh, as you... Uh -huh. um, I will also know... Randall, could you roll me a d20 and then a d100? As Rovel has so Boy, much howdy. a dragon surge. And you feel Yuki's presence waver for a second low. And then suddenly surge back as you have oh. gained the shaman and the fox back. Oh. Uh, D20 is a 13. D100 is a 4. D20. 4. You suddenly... You, f you, you feel your body make no sound whatsoever. As you... Um, as you see seven fish swim by you, completely un... Undisrupted by your presence, as you you notice your even when you you move in the water, you no noise comes off you, and you now have advantage in all stealth checks. And thank you, Yonsha and Yona, for the raid. I hello appreciate you guys being here. We are currently fighting a watermelon yokai on a bridge, and a bunch of well, one robot now, and a kitsune is stuck in a tree. I will heal low fly boy. Perfect. And I'm in the water. Oh, he Randall is also drowning. Moment. Wait, so like, if you speak <laughs> any noise even, like, I can't speak. You can speak, you can speak, you just can't, like, you make no noise, like, while moving the, you are the perfect stealth machine at the moment. I am pure stealth. Anything else you want to do, Lonika? As Yuki uh, just, like, starts howling. Apart from making him hear a low fly boy, no. <laughs> I don't want to do this, Lonika! As a howling, in, in between howls. Uh, just please for me, Yuki. <laughs> okay, my Kai. Fine. You just see him just through gritted teeth and just snarling. 
stupid lo-fi boy. Get healed, stupid. <laughs> and then just start singing at you. And you take, <laughs> you get healed. <laughs> Anything else you want to do, uh, Lonico? Uh, no, I'm just watching Randall and making <laughs> sure I'm casting shape water around him. Yeah, you got you got him safe as Randall. Yeah, you you recognize the debris from Kasakawa. Who are you passing your turn to, Low? Uh, I will pass it. Has Randall been? Randall has. Uh, yes. Yeah. Randall has. Uh... I was going to hold my and slice watermelon boy, and then that turned <laughs> on me pretty quick. <laughs> <laughs> that's karma, is what that's called. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, Satoshi hasn't gone has he? Satoshi hasn't there, yeah. Uh, I will give it to Satoshi. Perfect. Everyone roll for me a con save, please. Except for Everyone? Randall. Oh. Except for Randall. Everyone? Where is it? Uh, it's above the uh, the skills like acrobatics, animal handling, and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. It's in the uh, the little box ah. above that area. I see it. It's Toshi also gonna roll it. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! 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 Low, Rak Rocky, Lo-Fi Boy, and Satoshi, you guys all plant yourselves, keeping yourself in the ground. As you feel this sudden strong wind just blow in from the west, as you hear ravens call aggressively. And on their words, you just hear, <clears throat> The winds have eyes, and I am their voice. As this blows by, blows through, and you hear just that call through every raven call. As Polly, you feel your body get pushed back 15 feet and get knocked onto Great. your ass. Love it. And you like the as the wind like pushes into you, you feel it like cut at you all. As you all take, everyone take three damage except for Polly. You take six. Great. Even with your rage, you take full six, uh, full three damage. Uh, Lock my boy. But yeah, uh, it is now. Um, Sorry, whose turn was it <laughs> as that happened? Sorry. Uh, Satoshi. Satoshi. All right. Yeah. Satoshi is going to... From where you are, Lo-Fi Boy, uh, they're going to rush in and then cast Thunder Wave on themselves. Once I find which she is theirs. Oh, no, they're not. Sorry. They're going to use their Kung Fu because their Kung Fu is strong. <laughs> and they got a punch at the ACU. What a... Oh, as they get caught by the fist of <laughs> of the ACU, and they f you see Lo uh, Lofi Boy, the ACU like push in on Satoshi's fist, and you feel him just kind of like contort, or you see him contort as oh 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 that's oh that's a bit more force now. Oh oh goodness, ooh, <laughs> Satoshi says in pain, and it's going to use his action to slash with this Naginata. At, uh, Satoshi as a reaction luckily Satoshi is just contouring very awkwardly <laughs> and is just moving in just such a weird way that like the the ACU is like just so waterlogged and just rusted and damaged that you just can't slash at uh, at the um, at the water genasi and they're gonna pass the turn over to um, Rocky all right um, is there still the... There's one more mech dude left. There is, yeah. I mean... <laughs> um... I don't really know what to do. Because even if I ran... Do I still have it if I run away 30 feet away from this dude that I'm going to get screwed for it? You like opportunity attack? I don't think he would. No, not opportunity attack, but uh, I had a thing. Yeah, where, it's got a uh, compelled earlier, duel. Yeah, compelled um, duel. So if, I you, know yeah, if you stay a few away from you, you have to. Um, well, you succeed. No, you failed the deck save, didn't you? Or the wisdom can't save. Um, mm, so you can't move thirty feet out of his range or out of their range. And if you okay. attack anything else, you get disadvantage. Plus, you have minus ten on your movement. 
Well, yeah, that, and then also, but I do also have advantage on everything attacks, so that kind of yeah. negates that. Cancel but, uh, yeah. there really isn't much I can do at the moment, and I don't want to fight him, because he's on our side at the moment, but also, everybody seems like, it's just the one dude left of, that they're fighting, right? Mm -hmm. Y'all need my help! <laughs> Ran oh, Randall's struggling. Um, <laughs> you, stinking. you see, you, you just I, see like a bit of Randall's horn in the water. I, I want to go try to get Randall out of the water. <laughs> you go ahead, yeah. You um, can. Lo's just looking through the hole he made. <laughs> <laughs> you good, Randall? You good, buddy? How deep is this river? It goes pretty deep. It's about like I'd say sixty feet in like the center. Oh, Holy shit. oh shoot! That okay, so oh my God. it's about thirty feet over here. How do I save him from drowning? What do I need to do? He's about 10 feet in, so like you can kind of like... I fish in this river, let's just say oh that. Oh my god. <laughs> I have shape water up to 30 feet, so... Yeah, it's like... <laughs> Randall's sinking, right, but not... you can try and reach in for him. You, can, you also have your, his katana, your, your katana, he can grab on or something. Hmm? You can reach down from, but like, he is uh, 10 feet in the water. Um, I mean... And I weigh like a brick. <laughs> I'm, I'm strong, I guess. I mean, I, I, mean, I guess. I guess I'm gonna reach. I, I want to get. I can swim. You can swim. So I, I guess I'll just sink or swim, Rocky. We didn't mean like this. <laughs> I, will, I will jump in the water right, right around here, and try to like lift him up above the water from sinking more. Mm -hmm. Me can only lift ten pounds. <laughs> Roll strength. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, it's only attack rules that I get advantage on, right? Yeah. Yeah. Ugh. You have inspiration Ugh. though as well. It's true. Do you like, how do you dive I, into the water? Do you jump down, jump off the sides or like you jump in into the hole? I, I jump off the side. I don't jump in the hole. That uh, seems like a, like I'm going to just jump on him. I don't yeah. know. Yeah. <laughs> Break his neck or something. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Yeah, roll. Yeah, I'm just like looking at this, like at the mech piece down here, just like, oh, like that's so cool. <laughs> As I'm, yeah, you just get to see Rocky just swim in front of you and then push you up through the that's hole. A, that's a twenty-two. Yeah, you, 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 you push him straight up the hole. Wait. What? <laughs> you push him through the crack. He wait. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> the you push him through the the chunk of the bridge that he had fallen through. You push me through the breach. Goodness. Is that not okay? Breach? Nah, that's fine. Breach is fine. People. It's just like we try and I just realizing what I've done. Also, First, by the leak. way, the result for yeah. the leak and squirt was... Uh, An astounding goddamn landslide. Let me the see. The results for the leak and squirt. Yeah. That's leak and right. squirt are bad. <laughs> yeah, I could have told you that one. Yeah, we, we were telling him, and he was like, no, 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 no I don't, words. I don't think so, guys. We're not rolling words that are just commonly used in sentences now. If I'm able to help pull Randall up, I would need to try. I will allow yeah. you, you are able to, but like, when you pull him up, you, he is hefty in this moment. And you see Rocky. Get me off of this bridge, I'm gonna break it. <laughs> <laughs> if you break my bridge, you pay, you pay for it. Pay. Yeah, yeah, we know the rule. We'll deal with you later, buddy. <laughs> Anything else you'd like to do? Me? Um, no, I guess not. I mean, there's nothing else I can do. There is the squeaker uh, and Thank you. The, the ACU left to uh, to do their turn. ACU and who? As uh, uh, squeaker. Okay. Uh, I guess I. Mm. Give it to him. Watch him alone, friend. So what gonna, he's not gonna do anything either. You can't you can barely. I'll give he it to the watermelon guy. Crazy things. I don't know. Maybe I'll give it to the watermelon like dude. Right. <laughs> watermelon guy. <laughs> six seconds. Who knows? As the watermelon, as the sweet obake rushes past you, Randall. Would you like to use your hold action? <laughs> 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 they rush very like ready to like go attack the ACU. I feel like it's an awkward situation right now. I, like, I don't think I'm gonna do it. I don't think. Let's see what you got, buddy. Let's see what you can do. As they, I couldn't believe this rubble. <laughs> As they begin rushing. 
towards the ACU unit. They just dash beside you, uh, Lord Purple. As like they're dashing by, you see a bead of sweat holding onto like the skirt of the speaker back, and it leaps onto the ACU unit. And as soon as it touches the ACU unit, you see it just like go into like um, one of the um, the cracks in its armor, and you see it just kind of just shift and pull itself up a bit, and gains some healing. What? It gained six healing from Rover. <laughs> if I wanna just do this. <laughs> it is allowed. <laughs> just just Robo. <laughs> Robo. But at the same time, Satoshi also gets a fleck of water swirl around them and they get a chat inspiration as well. As the Suiko Barke comes in, goes for th two slashes with its katana on the ACU and then headbutts it with its giant watermelon head. <laughs> Grab 